Okay, we're doing an audio check, quick check. Another check. Okay, looks like we are good.
All right. I'm smiling because you guys are so cute. We had so many people in the Just Starting Skin screen. You guys are crazy. The one thing I love... Oh wait, I should not say love. I really like about you guys is I have a lot of chatters. It's not often that you see someone my size with a boatload of chatters. You'll be down in the entire stream, Sag, Caspian, Sag. Okay, chatters, we have a banger stream lined up for today. <laughs> Hi, Raven. Hi, chatters. Hope everyone is doing well today. Um, it is a bit warmer out. The guns are- wait, 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 wait. The- oh shit! Guns are out today. Um, we love chatting with you, peace. I do evil smell. Fuck. Okay, so plan for today, we're gonna do Mario Kart, but as you can tell by the title, Stop it, Max. Stop it. Um. Oh, I did mail this. Look at this. It stands out so much against the black. It is like this bright, kind of creamy neon orange, and then I put glitter on the ring finger. That's my look I did yesterday. Yeah, I did this wallpaper about two weeks ago, but thank you, Snakey Jiggy. <laughs> um. I was gonna say, I wanted something brighter, because I was kind of sad last week, so I was like, you know, we're doing happy bright nails this week. Um. Okay, I hope you have fun on your trip. I know some chatters. We're gonna eat cookies today. We're getting to that. We are getting to that, guys. So, you guys are distracting. You guys are stalling. So, I have a couple things to say. Um, so, we are going to start off with... Stream ends when I get all 200cc 3 Star Gold trophies. I think I have 3 left. 3. Finally, I think I could do it today. Also, I'm leaving this extra light on because I kind of like... We discovered last week during the calligraphy stream... Sometimes the glasses will get like a little glint and it's cool. So we're gonna try out that second line today. Um, so we're gonna do that first. So stream ends when I get all trophies. So if we don't have time for Animal Crossing today, fuck it. We'll just do Mario Kart all day. Um, so we're gonna do that. If we beat it early, then we'll do Animal Crossing. If not, then we will do tasting cookies. Hi, Nix. Welcome to stream. So chatters. I wait. There's another announcement. Wait, fuck. I have so much. Okay, one second. I gotta find the post. Hi, Giorgio. Welcome to stream. Okay. So, chat. At the end of stream, after Mario Kart and Animal Crossing, some of y'all have been hounding me to try Crumble. And I have tried Crumble one time. My sister brought me leftover chocolate chip cookies from her workplace one day. I got a little nimble. I got a, like, a half a bite. So, chat has been bullying me to try them. So, you know what? Yesterday, I was like, I'm gonna treat myself. I'm gonna buy some fucking cookies. I got the 12 party pack because we're a family of four. We're gonna eat them all in like two days. I checked this morning. Okay, so. <laughs> Hi, mashed potato. Welcome to stream. <laughs> we are looking. Okay, so now chatters can like shut up and tell me to not buy them. Unless. Okay, the thing I hate about Crumble, and the reason why I do- I've been like holding off actually trying them for so long- We'll get into this later, but they have weekly flavors, so this is gonna be bad if I like them too much. It's gonna be a problem, but, you know, it's fine. So this was the box from yesterday. As you can see, hmm, part of a cookie is missing. It is gone, because my motherfucking sister, I told her, I was like, hey- don't eat any- I'm gonna take a picture that's gonna be cute. And she's like, okay. And then she fucking ate, like, half of this cookie, so I'm mad at her. Um, so we're gonna be doing this at the end of stream, but what I did do is I prepped whenever- the, with these- with, the, uh, with these bigger cookies, I usually cut them like, fours. So you can see, I pre-cut little samplers for me that we can try at the end of stream. So chatter, stick around. Your sister's so relatable. I know, right? I fucking hate her. In a video game. <laughs> so, out of all the cookies from Crumble, I got, I think, four to five different kinds yesterday, but I've only had the chocolate chip, because, theoretically, I've had it before, so we'll do blind taste of all the other flavors, which we'll do later, so look forward to that, guys. Because if I eat now, it's gonna be a problem. <laughs> oh, no. I'll look at that later. I'll look at that later, Degon. Um, another thing, before we start, a quick announcement. Wait. <laughs> Wait, I gotta pull up the tweet. I gotta pull up the tweet. I usually chatters. Um, I will post announcements and stuff on Twitter. So if you aren't already, go follow my Twitter. It is PSIN17 with no underscore. So chatters, we're looking at it right now. So if you aren't already, go follow. Please, for the love of God, go follow my Twitter. Um, last announcement for today is any for any viewer for the month of July, 
who gifts a cumulative, so a total of five subs throughout the whole month, I will make you a custom portrait sketch card. So I made these, I whipped these out yesterday really quick. They take about 20-30 minutes. Um, as I said here, <clears throat> I won't be able to mail them out because I don't want to leak my address. But, we will do a special stream where I will, basically an extra art stream, where I'll draw the portraits on stream for people who choose to gift. Um, you'll download Twitter just for me. Thank you, Raven. Do it. <laughs> okay, so I actually have them here in person. Oh, the white balance is fucked. Okay. So it chatters. Um, let's actually look at them. Let's look at the best one first. <laughs> I thought this one was cute. These are four by three, so they're a little bit bigger than like a baseball card. Like I said, I won't be able to mail them out, but I'll do them on stream. So for any chatters, even lurkers too, I know we got some lurkers, we don't necessarily have chatters, but for anybody who gifts five subs to the Twitch channel, not on TikTok, because I don't have subs on TikTok yet, we will do sketch cards for you. Preferably, if you're going to want to do it, I want pictures of you yourself. Um, I'm not going to do portraits of celebrities or anything. But yeah. Well, let's put the bet. This one came out literally perfect. Look at that shit. The render. Perfect. Okay, that's, that's, that's like all the announcements I have for today. Nothing else much happened, so that those are just a little bit of updates for you guys. But before you get started, let's go ahead and get our sub goal up for the day. Let's see. Um, I have fallen off. We are down to 36 subs. Fuck. Okay, let's see. If we're at 36, then let's put our goal at 45 for today. <clears throat> Clearly doesn't love us as much- No, I, I don't have a P.O. box. I'm not gonna rent out a P.O. box for a hundred bucks a month. No, I think it's 30. I looked in my area and it's 30. I'm not gonna rent it out for 30 bucks. I'm not doing that. I'm not doing that. <laughs> oh my god! Chipotle, you're crazy! You wanted that portrait, didn't you? <laughs> oh my god, let's see who got it. We got Sneaky Jakey, Mashed Potato, Giorgio, MJ, and JWN. Dude, literally all active chatters today. Let's fucking go. I'm glad! Thank you, Butler! I appreciate that! Okay, so Butler, um, if you have a Twitter, you can DM me on Twitter the picture of you you want me to draw. Like I said, it will be at the end of the month, but you can send it to me now. We got until the end of the month to send it to me, so... Thank you! Also, since Butler gifted, they will get their name written at the end of stream, at the end of stream in our journal. But once again, thank you! Dude. Okay. Hi, welcome to Stream Water. Hope you're doing well today. Okay, enough stalling, enough shilling, let's actually get started with the fucking game. I've been stalling for 10 minutes. Let's get started. Okay, I didn't fix the white balance on my camera either, because I was going to do it right before stream. But then I was like, eh, I don't know. <laughs> okay, so we're doing single player, 200cc, Avi. We're also going to be doing predictions every... Oh, do any chatters want to change my character? Anybody? Anybody? Uh, what what does the emote only reward do? So there's different um, types of chat rooms I can have. Right now we're in follower only. That means people who want to chat have to be following. Any chatters want to redeem the character? You've got 10 seconds! Um, so for emote only, that means nobody can type words. You just can only type emotes. Daisy? Okay. Oh, I got confused. I was like, aren't I already on Daisy? But it was Peach. I got confused. Okay, we're doing Daisy. Thank you for redeeming, Butler. Okay. So, I- Okay, there's shit on my dresser. I forgot to clean my room. Okay, well, I did clean my room, but that just means I shuffled stuff around. There's stuff blocking the TV in key places. <clears throat> Which Kirby game did you get next? Did you get um, Forgotten Land or Allies? It's out of stock for you. Yeah, it's a time. It's a timed reward. Okay. Um, so we need Egg Cup. <clears throat> we need Crossing. Bell. Oh, we oh, fuck. Wait, did I miss one? <gasps> oh my god. Thank you for the gifted sub, Mac. I appreciate that. You're going to get your name. Written at the end of stream. The stream lagged. <clears throat> you might have to refresh your tab or your phone. Guys, guys, chatters, chatters. 
if you look at the top of your chat box, do you guys see that? We are very close to a hype train. So how hype trains work, if we have one more person gift or cheer, then people for five minutes, whoever gifts and cheers more, can earn exclusive emotes, chatters. We are very close to hype train. We just need one more person to donate. Anyway. <coughs> Sorry, my throat is fucked up today. I don't- I'm, I haven't gone out, I'm not sick. Okay, so, we need bell, crossing, egg. So that just means we need <clears throat> three more cups. Okay. Well, should I start off with an easier one? I kinda wanna start off with an easier one. That way I don't let myself down too easy. Let's do special cup for funsies. Let's do it for fun. <clears throat> but let's go ahead and get our first prediction up of the day. We're gonna be doing predictions every race. <clears throat> One second, I'm getting that set up for you guys. Okay, prediction is up, go Gamba. Oh my god, you're crazy, Mac! Another gifted sub, you're crazy! <laughs> but thank you, Mac, I appreciate that. You're oiling me up today, man. Okay. <clears throat> so, chatters, gentle reminder. New Gamba is up. Will I get first on the first race of the day? It is not one of my more difficult frees. <laughs> but it is one that is somewhat difficult. We all can spin. Yeah, now all the chatters can spin to distract. <laughs> Look, I love that overlay so much. Isn't that fucking cool? <clears throat> okay. I need to hide this overlay. There we go. Okay, let's go. <laughs> Spin time. <laughs> you guys are so silly. You guys are so silly. <laughs> I was playing offline with my sister yesterday and then her friend. Both of which, they don't play Mario Kart often, so they usually play like once every few months. But I was fucking creaming them. I was so good. I was like a solid quarter of a lap ahead of them the whole time. And they were like, Megan, I didn't know you were good at this game. I'm like, yeah, dude, I'm literally so cracked. Because, <laughs> like, and, like, chatters will sometimes be like, Megan, you're trash at the game. Or you suck. Or, like, they'll see the TikTok clips and, like, oh, but you get last all the time. And it's like, bruh, that's online. If it's computers, I fucking slam. You know what be funny? You know what be funny? Like the piece I 2 spin? That'd be a good like gambling emote. <laughs> okay, not saying I'm gonna gamble. We're not gonna take a sponsorship with steak. I'm not clouded enough for that anyway. But oh my god, that's the second bolt today. <clears throat> oh my god, I saw the best copy pasta spam. I'll have to say, I'll, I'll find it for you guys later. But it is the funniest shit. Um, if you guys know like the XQC copy spam where it's like, don't get it twisted, like the gambling spam. I found one for like, don't subscribe, and it's so funny. I have to find it. I'll find it after this race. What emote piece I two spin? Oh no, oh no. <clears throat> oh, I said, I think I said Coggers. Because Coggers is a 7T verse, just a, a people shaped like a cog spinning. <clears throat> Chatters, if you do not have the. Th it's like the third lightning bolt today. Um, if you are on Twitch desktop and you do not have um, third-party extensions enabled, type exclamation extensions in chat and you will see a whole new world of emotes on Twitch desktop. I think they only work for Google Chrome, but you know, they're still fun. You said gambling? I did. Okay, let me find that copy pasta. Oh, fuck. I have to find it on desktop. <laughs> One second, one second. I'll find it. Man, we had a majority of believers that time. That's pretty good. <clears throat> okay. This is not one of the pre's we are grinding for, but you know, it's still a win. It's still a W. Okay, I need to find that message. 
my god, I found it, I found it! I sent it to my friend. Okay, guys, guys. Chatter, save this for the ad break, okay? Save this copy pasta for the ad break. So copy and paste it later. <laughs> but <laughs> who here isn't a sub, I don't imagine. It's because we get a lot of gifted, so. <laughs> you want to schedule your driving lesson? Let's go! Can we get some drakes and chat for Mac? I know this is a very big life decision, but congrats to you, man. Like, I know I still need to get my shit figured out. But good job, Mac. That's great. <clears throat> But isn't that copy pasta so good? Do not subscribe. Do not spend money here. Do not start donating. <laughs> it's so funny. I saw it in the song chat the other day and it was hilarious. So I want that copy pasta to be the new copy pasta whenever I have the ad break. I think extensions has an S in it, right? I get that confused too. But hi, welcome to stream Kirby. Hope you're doing well today. If you have any preferred nicknames or pronouns, make sure to tell me. <clears throat> I hate so, but I hate spending money on free apps. I totally feel that. But I'm at the point where I think a big contender what made me start like subscribing to people. Blue shell, literally no notification. Emote only mode for five minutes. Okay, we can do that. There we go, Kirby. It's an S. You were close. So chatters. <laughs> I can't drive, but I can punch. Oh no. Okay, so fast being redeemed. Emote only for five minutes. So we will see. You guys can, like, shut up for five minutes, right? <laughs> Wait, should I should I put a timer? I'll put a timer. Wait, chatters, hold. Hold. I'm, I'm still live. I'm just copying a layer. Calm down. Oh, fuck. Why is it not there? Huh? It's not showing. Oh, there it is. Okay, there's the timer. <laughs> okay, five minutes. Five minutes. <clears throat> what was I gonna say? Oh, yeah, we were talking about subscribing. But, like, a big contender that made me, like, start subscribing to people on Twitch is once I got YouTube Premium, like, where you essentially watch YouTube with no ads, it's impossible to watch Twitch with ads now. Like, if you're watching Twitch on a budget, I would highly recommend you look into Twitch Turbo. I repeat, Twitch Turbo is pretty solid. If you don't know what Twitch Turbo is, look it up. <laughs> Come on! So many bolts. Oh my god. Dude, it is so daunting looking at the timer on screen. Wait, is this the last lap? It is, isn't it? Aw, oh, thank you for the prime sub next. I appreciate that, hon. You're gonna get your name written at the end of stream. Let's go! Wait, what does slash P mean? I've never- wait, I've never seen slash P. Wait, you guys can't tell me! Fuck! Guys, you guys gotta answer my question in five minutes. Oh! Dodged like a bro? Okay, my lines are so sloppy today, but you know, it's fine, it's fine. <clears throat> wait, chatters, can you test something? If you do, um... Highlight my message for 1k points. Can you type a message in chat? Is that possible? Is that like a workaround? Man, we had 99% and believe you guys are crazy. Let's go. <clears throat> yeah, on to the next one. Can we be in emo only mode the whole time? <laughs> I kind of like it. It's funny. Okay, new prediction is up. I don't know. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Okay, well, chatters, if you do highlight my message, you can type words in the chat room. We, we have found a workaround. <laughs> so, if you want to drop 1k points, then you can talk to me. <laughs> For only three more minutes. Oh! 
Sorry. Oh my god, perfect! I played this map like five times yesterday because I was- My sister, she kept choosing this map for some reason because she knows I hate it. And I ran into that wrecking ball like five times and I got so mad. Oh, we're talking about another time my sister pissed me off. I was playing Mario Party with her friend the other day. And, okay, what happened was, it was a 20, um, it was a 20 turn map. And we were like 15 turns in, I had like one star and she had four. And then due to like straight RNG and luck, I got like three golden pipes because I had a boatload of coins built up the whole game. So I, I went from like one, one to four stars. It was crazy. And she got so mad, she exited the game and like stole the controller from my hand. I was like, what the fuck are you doing? And I thought like we lost the data, but apparently with the um, new Super Mario Party All-Stars, if you exit out the game, it still saves the game data the next time you open the game. So thankfully, we were able to retrieve the um, save data, but I was like, I was so mad. I mean, I didn't like yell at her or like hit her or anything, because that's bad. That's bully behavior. But still, like, I don't think I've ever been like a poor sport when it comes to a game. Like, if I lose, then it's my fault. I just need to be better next time. Like, I'm never the type to get angry about those type of things. Oh! I fell off. You kinda smell. Dude, I put on deodorant this morning, I took a shower. I am squeaky clean, okay? Oh! Zoom in! From rags to riches, from fifth to first? I'm in the dirt! Easy. Easy. Man, we have 1k in belief? Sheesh! You guys are brazen. <laughs> okay, we got... 15 more seconds left on that timer. I'll sing a song? Okay. I'll do it after this race, Nyx. I'm glad you're gonna be here for long today, too. I think you said earlier you can stay today, but I'm really happy. It's been a while since we've chatted, Nyx. Okay, timer's off. Now you guys can start talking again. Be nice. Don't be weird, champ. First stream? Nice, let's go! I have welcome to stream. MJ, they, them? Okay. Sounds good. But I hope you're doing well today. Thank you for chatting. Okay. <laughs> I hate this part. Literally the worst. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. And some of you know, my, my controller is broken. Prediction? I need mods, guys. <laughs> okay. Prediction's up. Oopsie. <laughs> there we go. I mean, I don't know how it's gonna go, honestly. Honestly. We will see. You enjoy the TikTok? Let's go, guys! Another TikTok frog! Um, type a one in chat if you found me on TikTok. And then type two if you found me somewhere else, which is, like, literally impossible. Because literally all you little frogs are from TikTok. Ah! Okay. Nano shot fuck. Oh no, the margins are not in my favor in this prediction. You know what? I'm gonna come back. I'm gonna I'm gonna come back. I just need to like maybe I need to be on emote only mode for five minutes and not talk. Maybe that's it. Maybe that's what I need to do. Okay, I'll nail it this time. I'll nail it this time. Look at me, look at me. Oh I had it! I almost had it! You found me on wiki feet? No shot. No way. No way. See, I'm literally- I don't see any twos in chat. Hmm. Oh, slash P meant positive? Oh, platonically? Okay. <laughs> oh, okay, I don't know. What, what does it mean? Somebody tell me. Is it platonic or positive? I'm always on your For You page. Let's go. Let's go. It, I feel bad, because, like, I usually won't follow somebody. Because I know once I follow them, they show up on my For You page left. Or, For You page less. Snipe them! I got them! Easy clap! Okay, back and first, back and first. Guys, I can do it, I can hold. I'm gonna nail this turn this time. <gasps> Look at that! Oh my god!
It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Hey, Mario fell off. He wears first place. No, please. Oh, the blue shot went for them. Holy shit. You get some peace, I do vibes. Anytime I do this or put my hands up, I'm like, peace, I do vibe. Dude, I would never kick a dog. Nyx is literally slandering me in this chat room. Yeah, actual clutch. I came back. That was insane that round. And we had a majority of doubters? Man, you guys should know. <laughs> I almost clicked doubt by accident for the outcome of the prediction. That would have been bad. That would have been bad. <laughs> I was a baby in 2003. I would have been four. <laughs> Dude, guys, I'm 23. I'm fucking old. Well, at least you didn't lose too many points, Hacker. That would have been sad. Okay, now we are done warming up. We're going to actually try and go for... Oh, sing a song. Thank you, Nyx. I would have forgotten. Oopsie. <laughs> okay, oopsie. Thank you, Nyx. Um, okay, I got to find a song. <clears throat> Wait, you're 23, yeah. Imagine. Is that bad? Is that banned? No, Boomer is like 50 plus, right? No, I'm not- I'm not a- I'm not a teenager. It's weird, like, people either think I look young or I look old. Yeah, I'm looking for a song right now. <laughs> Boomer is 60? See, I'm not that old. Oh, wait, wait, wait. You guys see that highlight right on the glasses. Ooh, I love that. We're gonna leave this light on. Okay, I gotta find a song. No, I don't. Explain the cutscene. Explain the cutscene. It was your birthday yesterday. Really? Was it actually your birthday yesterday, Nick? That's crazy. If it was, can we get some um, feel birthday feels birthday man in chat for Nick? <clears throat> Ooh, okay, I, I can maybe do this one. Okay. Fourth of July birthday, damn. Okay. So, chatters. Throughout the stream, you can use your channel points. And I will sing a song for chat. So, if you want to check out previous singing clips, I just linked it in chat. <laughs> Me and your mom are destined to be in together. Oh, got him. Got him. Okay, let's sing a song. <clears throat> so I'm going to do um, Bottle It Up by Sarah Borelli. And as I'm singing, chatters, chatters, feel free to spam your favorite animated, your favorite hype emotes in the chat room, because that makes me happy to see. Look at that. Highlight. I love the light. I love it. Okay. I love shiny things. Okay. So I'm gonna try and sing the final verse. Let's get some water. We'll warm up. <clears throat> okay. <laughs> Shine like a star. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> What started as a flicker meant to be a flame Skin has gotten thicker, but it burns the same Still a baby in a cradle, gotta take my first fall Baby's getting next to nowhere With her back against the wall He meant to make me happy, made me sad Wanna make it better, better, so bad Save your resolutions for your never new year. There is only one solution I can see here. There we go. That's the final verse. <clears throat> I kind of want to do the second verse. It's pretty good. I love it. I love all of um, Sarah Borelli's earlier songs. She also did a 
a whole soundtrack for a musical, which is crazy. <clears throat> I think. Thank you guys. Sing WAP. No, I. <laughs> the only line I know is WAP. Not the acronym, but the actual phrase. I'll look at it later, Deacon. <clears throat> I kind of want to do the second verse for funsies. Yeah, I listened. I think I listened to half of the album for Waitress. <clears throat> we can understand the sentiment you're saying to us. Hope we're sensible selves. Could, so could you kindly shut up and get started at keeping your part of the bargain? Oh, please, little darling. You're killing me, sweet little love. Love, love, love. Love, love. <laughs> No, we are not doing WAP, Chatters. We are not. No, we are not doing it. Don't. <laughs> Macaroni in a pot. I don't know. I don't know what it is, Chatters. I'm not doing WAP. I don't take requests. Because I'm not going to sing a song that I don't know. So maybe, maybe. Maybe I can learn it. And it, it might take me a long time to learn. Like, So let's say it might, it might take me like three months to learn it. Maybe then I can do it. Handshakes? Does that sound fair? If I learn it, maybe I'll perform it? <laughs> no! No, Kaz, we're not singing it. We're not singing Kaz, Chatter, stop. Stop! Stop! Chat. <laughs> you guys are cringe. <laughs> no! Butler, no! Don't make that the new meta. No! That's not gonna be the new meta. Don't do it. <laughs> Chat is feral today? No, they're, they're not nearly as crazy as they usually are. We just have more chatters, so you just seem more chaotic. Okay, let's play the fucking game. Uh, anybody want to change my character? Anybody want to change my character? Okay, nobody redeemed. We'll keep doing Daisy for now. <clears throat> okay. So we're gonna actually try and shoot for the prees that I need to get three stars in. So the ones I need is Egg Cup, Crossing Cup, and Bell Cup. Thank you for redeeming, Raven. I'll switch out to Boo. Oh, I hate doing Boo. I think King Boo is Hacker's main, but it's too heavy for me. Actually, it might be helpful for some of the more difficult ones. Hmm... It says it expired. You didn't redeem it fast enough. Sag. <clears throat> okay. Let's see. If we're looking at these three cups, I think a heavier character will be better for this spree. <laughs> Here's the deal. When you do learn it, learn the second verse. Okay, I will try and learn the second verse. Boo is Keck L. Why? What? Why is it Keck L? <laughs> Okay, Chatter's prediction is up. I didn't forget this time. Go Gamba, go Gamba. Gamba, all your points. What is the mac and cheese? Is that one of, like, the references in the song? I don't know what it is. <clears throat> we got 2% of doubt. Okay. So, Chatter's, if you don't know how three-star gold trophies work, you have to get first in all four races. So if I mess up a race, then I'm resetting. I'm not wasting my time today. You got protection? I hate this turn. Not nearly as much as the one in Rainbow Road, though. <laughs> I think the noises that King Boo makes is kind of scary. I was playing Fall Guys before stream, and I thought to myself, isn't the Fall Guys sounds just like minions? Does anybody see the new minion movie? Because I haven't. And I kind of want to, but then I'm like, isn't that kind of cringe? But, like, the whole marketing scheme around it. Where, like, oh, bring all your friends and, like, dress up to go to the Minion movie. Like, it's all a marketing ploy. And it worked. I don't know how much they actually made in the box office in the opening weekend, but... 
I saw a lot of people on my TikTok for you page going to the minions. Ah! <laughs> you actually went in suits? Oh no. I mean, a little bit cringe, but you know, as long as you guys are having fun, it's fine. Oh, they got me, they got me. Fuck, oh, come on, I can catch up. Copium, I can catch up. <laughs> oh! Oh my god, no! You guys see that? I threw the red and then the, uh, Ludwig threw the banana right behind him. That was rude. Okay, I can do it, I can catch up. No, no, come on! Okay, like I said, I'm gonna reset if I don't get first during these pre's. So, did I get first? Not this time. Um, I need to go blow my nose real quick. So, give me a second, guys. Okay, well, we're gonna try again because we're grinding for three stars and I got a fucking third. And that's not cool. <laughs> okay, so, while I blow my nose... You guys can watch a quick, instant replay, okay? <laughs> same, Caspian, same. Okay, let's watch a replay. Like, I gotta sneeze, I gotta sneeze, I gotta sneeze. It feels like a bug flew in my nose. It does not feel good. Oh my god. I thought I had a nosebleed, but it's literally, I just saw my nails. <laughs> okay, I'm fine. Sanitizer, because I don't want to get snot on my controller. Treating us like iPad pig kids? Okay, well, I don't want you guys to leave, okay? You leave your chair for like 10 seconds and like 10 people leave. <gasps> Aww. Thank you for the bits, Nick. I'm gonna read out your message because it's really sweet. But I need my glasses. Hold. <laughs> okay, from Nick. In the three months I've been watching you, you've grown so much and I'm so perish socially proud. <laughs> you deserve every viewer, every sub, every donate that you find. I'm so happy to be a part of this community. And to be around so many new and poggers people. <laughs> Aw, you're so cute. Platonically and parasocially. I appreciate that, Nyx. You're so cute, hon. I appreciate it. Like, we have... It's nice to see how the stream has changed in the past few months. Because, like, I have consistently more viewers, more chatters. And it's nice to see, like, the people who stick around. And the people who are in stream or, like, in chat. And, like, at its core... I want chat to have a good time. And the way I see it, as long as I have a good time and make sure chat has a good time, then I'm doing a good thing. So I'm glad that it's had a positive impact on you, Nyx. I'm really glad. Um, we need problems? No! No, we'll save that for later. Get mad at me when I say crumble cookies are bad or something. But thank you, guys. Wholesome chatter. Whenever Nyx is here, they're a pleasure, so. <clears throat> now you're fine, Deacon. I don't care if people stream hop, honestly. I don't expect people to stay here the whole time. Like, I know I get bored of streamers sometimes, too, so. <clears throat> okay, my nose is still kind of fucky. It feel like, it legit feels like a bug flew in my nose and it's stuck there. Like, it still feels something. Because, like... This time of year, especially springtime too, like, my nose gets really dry, so then sometimes it'll bleed. Um, so I have to be careful. Anytime I feel it, I gotta, like, stop it, because, you know, blood is TOS. But... <laughs> I don't know how to feel about Animal Crossing. Damn. I see how it is, Decon. I see. <laughs> that is okay. That's why the stream is segmented. Like, there's different sections of the stream for different people. 
Still waiting for that fifth grade fighter stream? No. Didn't some- Okay, I think I got a comment saying, Hey, I'm a fifth grader, or I, when I was a fifth grader, I would have volunteered myself or something like that. And that was pretty good. That was pretty funny. But I don't think you could do that on stream. Like, wait, fifth graders, they would be like- They'd be like 11 at that point, right? I think that'd be child labor, so if they're on camera, I think you'd have to like pay them or something. Okay, not saying I wouldn't pay my actors, but... I can't afford that right now. <laughs> and like, wait, think about the insurance and liability of fighting multiple people on stream. And then I potentially like hurting them or something. If you stamp the heel of your side when the nose is bleeding, it's... What? Like in your abdomen, huh? I never heard that before. No, I used to get nosebleeds a lot when I was younger, too. I don't know why. Because, like, it never happened with my parents or my sister. It was just me. Maybe I was just, like, anxious or something. But it also could be, like, my nose is just really sensitive. I've never been able to smell really well. Just get rid of your nose. I wish I could. I don't... Okay. Um... Let's be insecure for a second, but I don't like the shape of my nose. I don't like how it's flat, but then I'm also like, getting a nose job is dumb. And like, it's not- to me it's not a good thing to alter your body for cosmetic purposes. Like, if it'll like, help your mental health, then I think that's fine. But I'm never going to like, get plastic surgery. Like, I'm never gonna do that. Am I a mouth breather when I sleep? I think so. I've been told I sometimes snore, but not all the time. My dad, he does have- what's it called when you can't breathe in your sleep and you have to wear a sleep apnea machine? Wait, he had- wait, no, it's because it's called sleep apnea, so that's why the machine is called a sleep pack. <laughs> oh, so he, he- he- he doesn't sleep well, so I, I think I got it from him. Yeah, you just said it, Lamau. <laughs> Five hit. Did I get first? Wait, I did get first, holy shit! That's like my worst map. On this brie, let's go. Uh, but like, I'm at the point where like I've accepted how I look, so I, I try not to get too insecure about shit. Because you know your face, you may not like one part, but it's a whole composition. It's just like an art piece. There's different parts you may like, and some pieces you will not like, or that you like, and some you don't like. So, like I personally, I like how my eyes are shaped. Because I never wear makeup, but I like how um, my eyelashes, like, kind of turn down. So sometimes, like, they're not necessarily big eyelashes, but they kind of, like, tilt downwards. So it kind of looks like I'm wearing, like, eyeliner sometimes. And I think it's cool. <clears throat> Thank you, Decon. I appreciate it. See, like, I think I'm cute. But. <clears throat> Spitting facts, yeah. Like, even in junior high, too, like, at peak puberty... I was never too, like, insecure about my looks because I was never, like, I wasn't raised to be, like, super hyper-feminine. My parents were always like, you know, you can wear whatever you want, you know. We prefer if you wear dresses or skirts if you want to, but, you know, you're old enough to decide what you want to wear. So, um, they never, like, taught, my mom never taught me how to make up, wear makeup, and she doesn't wear it all, um, often enough either, so. I never, like, grew up with people who wore, like, heavy makeup, so it just wasn't a part of my life. And, like, I'm old enough to a point where, like, I can learn how to do it on my own, but I've just go grown so accustomed to, like, how my natural face looks that I think if I tried to wear makeup, it would, like, fuck me up. In the sense of, especially with just, like, the American beauty standards, people expect you to wear makeup. So it's kind of like, if you wear it all the time and you don't wear it one time, people will, like, give you shit for it. So, it's just not something I can handle. And, like... Spending 30 plus minutes every day getting ready doing that shit? Bruh, never. Literally never. I don't think I can handle that. I can barely, like, get up and brush my teeth in the morning. But, yeah. Like, even in, like, the junior high locker rooms, I was never embarrassed of, like, how I looked. Because, like, I think I've just always been super body positive in the sense of it's not worthwhile to, I guess, hate on yourself. When there's already, already so many like outward negative opinions of you, like if you're gonna be like mean to yourself, then that's not helping you. That's just my kind of opinion on it. Oh come on, third place, come on. Sorry, I'm ignoring checks. I'm generally concentrating. I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry, chatters. I'm not a bad streamer. <laughs> oh god, first, come on. 
You don't like cookies? What? What is wrong with you, Raven? Like, legitimately, what is wrong with you? I look at chat and somebody says they do not like cookies. <laughs> I love how I was talking about body image and the chat just shifted gear to cookies. <laughs> um, crumbled cookies are too dry, really? Okay, we will talk about this later, Nix. We will- I will give my full review later, but we will talk about this. Wait, I got first, guys. Holy shit. Yeah, I- I have a big forehead, too. It used to be something that bothered me, but I'm just like, you know, big brain. <laughs> Yeah, see, even like the makeup videos you see on YouTube, they're either like so much trimmed down or fast forwarded. I can, I would never be able to justify spending so much time doing my makeup every morning. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I agree. I agree. I don't like hard cookies either. I like chewy cookies. I can agree with you on that, Raven. I just saw I don't like cookies, and that was the first thing I saw. And I was like, huh? What? Okay, Chatters, new Gamba's up. New Gamba. Okay, we are on track to get a three-star. We have two more races left. I think I can do it. I think I can do it. Peace I 2 pray. I can do it. Can we get some um, Peace I 2 praise in chat? I did tell you guys in the title to um, cheer me on. I want to see some um, Peace I 2 vibes and Peace I 2 praise. Let me pretty pog you. I went the wrong way. <clears throat> oh, wait. I didn't even talk about this at the start of stream, but Chatters... Um, I did a collab stream with my friend Cutie Lee on Sunday. Some of my chatters were there, so shout out to anybody who was there for the actual stream on Sunday. Um, I believe she is gonna have a highlight video up on YouTube of it hopefully soon, but we will see because, you know, she's a busy lady. But we essentially ranked fast food on a tier list, and we also did a tier list for chat. It was a pretty good stream. Um, I don't- fuck, I don't have the command activated anymore. Um, but I believe Cutie Lee is on my auto host list. So after stream, you can check out my auto host list, and then you can check out our channel. It's a pretty good stream. It was four hours long, though. I'm gonna be honest. Um, I thought it was only gonna take two, so I was, like, kind of dead after hour three. And honestly, I was, like, on the verge of pissing my pants. <laughs> like, in the final hour. My god! Fuck, fuck, fuck. That book, Burger King, in his place. I know, right? Hi, Tanuki. Welcome to stream. We're pretty well today, and thank you. We are gonna get the three remaining... Three star go trophies today. Like I said, streaming's not ending until I get them. But I will do it. It's been long. Where the fuck is first place? Oh my god. Oh, they're right there. Okay. Okay. It's fine. It's fine. We're only in second. We're not too far behind. Okay, wait. Fourth. What happened? What happened? I think playing as Boo is really bad for me, guys. Whoever chose Boo is a hate watcher. I swear. <laughs> Dog shit items. Bad game. You've been hit by lightning like eight times. I know, right? It's insane. Damn, we had 94% believe and 6% doubt that time. I'm sorry, believers. We gotta try again. We gotta reset the run. God damn. Like, I think this is my worst pre. Hands down, this is my worst pre. <laughs> okay, any chatters want to change my character? Please, for the love of God, I don't want to play Boo anymore. I know we love King Boo, but I, I'm not good with him. <laughs> like a lightning rod, literally. <laughs> hey, please, please, somebody change it, please. I don't want to play Boo anymore. No, if you put me in a tall building, I'll fall off. I'm so clumsy. Chatters, please change it. Thank you, Wario. Oh no, no. I just saw who it was. Fuck you, Mac. You're not helping. God damn it. Uh... Lamo. I'm not angry. You, you might see it, but like, I'm kind of grinning. 
You can change it back after this attempt. But I don't- I don't- I want a lighter character! I don't like the heavy ones, you guys know that! Me and Decon are funny? Keep telling yourself that. See what happens. <laughs> hey Chad, his new Gamba's up. Do you think I'll get first this time? This is our third time racing at Neo Bowser City today. <clears throat> I'm gonna do it this time. I think Wario does handle a little bit better than Boo. Oh my god, I snuck them both. You guys see that shit? Oh my god, I'm correct. No protection, of course. I I literally had a perfect drift that time. No items? Okay. No, I usually do like a middleweight or lightweight. Because heavy ones, you have to change your braking style a lot more. You have to brake a lot less. And it's very difficult. <clears throat> I know, you would think Boo would be a light character, but no. They are not. The lore doesn't line up. It's kind of weird. It's not canon. Okay, I messed up the drift, but you know, I didn't fall off that time. Okay, I got a good lead right now. I got a good lead. Is Gold Mario a heavyweight character? They're not midway? Because they usually use Gold Mario or um, Metal Peach. But are they considered heavyweight characters? Okay, we have two methods of protection. We are solid, we are protected. I ruined the drift. There was literally no notifications. Literally no alert that a blue show is coming. You know, it's fine. We got ghosted. You know, I ghost my friends for fun. <laughs> Wait, no. Oh, fuck. I meant to say they ghost me. Oopsie. <laughs> he doesn't deserve to be judged. Well, I don't like playing him, okay? Did I get first? Yes, I did. You know who else is taking L's right now? Chatters who are non-subs because you know what is coming? An ad break. But... You can avoid that ad break by subscribing for just $4.99, just $5. Skip your coffee today and get ad for viewing all month long. Or, if you have an Amazon Prime, you can link it to your Twitch account and get a free Prime sub every month. And if you have any secret Oilers, now is the time to gift. We are doing 5 gifted subs equals a custom portrait. <laughs> Do not subscribe. Do not spend money here. <laughs> um, Chatters, we are... An hour industry. <laughs> Chatters, please keep this copy pasta like clipped to your clipboards with your copy and paste. It's so fucking good. <laughs> oh, there's probably some lurkers, like non chatters who aren't subbed, but you know, it's fine. <laughs> Sub, y'all. <laughs> yeah, can we get some more subs, guys? I fell off. I fell off over the weekend. Anyway, anyway, Chatters, no stalling, I'm stalling. We will see some of you guys in a few. Please get some water. Get a snack if you need it. We're going to continue with this run after the break. So stick around. <laughs> Coffee pasta is so good. <laughs> it's so good. Oh my god. <laughs> Yeah, I'm about to just ignore Decon. Okay. <clears throat> um, I'm working on getting the stars offline, and I think I have the two final worlds left. And it's gonna take me a long ass time to beat it, Hacker, but I'm working on it. I'm not gonna do it on stream because it's gonna—it's not gonna be fun to watch. So once I have all the stars, we will do 
a stream where we do the final level. Hi, Vengeance. Welcome to stream. Hope you're doing well today. <clears throat> okay, Chatter Shatters, new Gamba is up. New prediction is up. Ribbon Road. I can do this one. Hi, Claire. Welcome to stream. Hope you're doing well today, hon. Okay, I'm gonna focus this time. We're not gonna do the row. <clears throat> yeah, I, I accidentally saw a clip of the final level and I got annoyed. But it does not look fun. So I'm gonna stall as much as I can. <laughs> oh, um, I know I said I want to replay Super Mario Odyssey at some point. But... Um, I kind of want to do a stream where I just grind darker side. I don't know how fun it'll be, but... Because uh, if anybody's played Odyssey, darker side is fucking insane. It's basically like a level where it's like 10 different levels in one. And it is crazy. Come on, hit him! Oh! They tried to get me! But you missed! Nice drive! Yeah, Darker Side is insane. Have you beaten it, Nyx? I've, I've yet to beat it. I think I got to the part with the birds. Because that, that's the part where I, I just quit. I was like, I can't handle this anymore. Maybe we can make that a sub-goal stream. I don't know. I'll think about it. I'll think about it! Fuck! Yeah, it's difficult, Chatters. Watch clips of it online. It is insane. Because I've been trying to watch um, the clips of the areas that I've seen. So I will always like skim through. Hi EJ, welcome to stream. Hope you're doing well today. If you have any preferred nicknames or pronouns, make sure to tell me. Oh, I'm going the wrong way! <laughs> no, come on, come on. We're fine, we're fine. We can come back. Although the computers suck. Third? Yeah, I'm gonna save the screen. First! No way, no way. Please, don't do this to me. Do not do this to me. Okay. We are good. Hi, Luigi. Welcome to stream. Okay. That one was close. That one was way too close. Okay. We are good. We are back where we were last time. Gonna head into the train track. Hopefully, this one will not screw me over this time. Because I... I don't know if I can handle another loss. It was close. It was insane. Because I wasn't sure if it was targeting me or Mario. Oh, new prediction? Let's get that going. <clears> he <throat> chatters, new prediction is up and running. Go Gamba. This is the one that got me last time, but not this time. No, no, not this time. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Okay. Um. Hi, Nazarin. Hope you're doing well today. Fuck, wrong button. Um, I don't have any more animated emote slots open for subs, but if I were to swap out the piece I two nope, would you guys like a finger a finger waggling one? I think that'd be funny. Thoughts? Cause like no literally nobody uses the peace I two nope, unfortunately. Sag. Oh my god, I hate this part! Oh my god! Thank you for another gift of some Mac, you're crazy! Did you get your paycheck or something? Oh my god, the <laughs> But thank you, Mac, I appreciate that, hon. Yeah, I think a finger waggling would be funny. Like, anytime I have, like, a bad take or I mess up in the game, you guys can be like, tsk, tsk, and do, like, the finger waggling or something. Maybe we can pose for that today. I'll do that today. We'll do it later. Fuck! Because I, I can export it later today. That way you, get, you guys can have it, like, tomorrow, maybe. Fuck! Yeah, I, I hate this stage, too. It's literally the worst. Literally the worst. This whole pre is just absolute dog shit. And you know it's after this track? Isn't it fucking Big Blue? Another insanely difficult track? Ooh, 
the shell. Okay. So we have full protection. How am I in third? No! Don't do this to me. Are they both tiny? Oh my god! Oh my, oh my god! Come on! Okay. <laughs> Finally. <laughs> Finally. <laughs> I need water. Yeah, I like the music for this track, but otherwise, dog shit. You gotta go, no problem, Lemon. We'll see you next time. Okay. We had a 50-50 split, but you know, I still clutched and got a first there. I had no doubt in you winning. Thank you, Potato. I appreciate that. We love our hardcore believers. You know, there's not a lot of them, but you know, we love them. Parasocially, of course. <laughs> okay, chat. This is the final race of this pre. We have been grinding this motherfucking pre for months. But today's the day I'm gonna get that three star gold trophy. We're gonna do it right here, right now. <clears throat> okay. Fuck you. Yeah, Big Blue isn't that hard. It's just I don't play it very often, so... The m I think the hardest line is the one I just did with the moving conveyor belts. Oh, this line too. This one always gets me. But with Wario, I am going a bit slower, so it's not as bad. Oh! Oh my god! I, I was looking at the wrong drag! He double item box. Protection. Final stretch. I don't have a big lead, but you know, it's something. Oh! oh I almost run down. <laughs> I'm, I knock it at the green path. Second! What the fuck? I'm cursing a lot. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, chatters. I am sorry. But actually not, because cursing is funny. Finally, we have received. Come on, hurry up! A three star gold trophy in Bell Cup. Finally, that took 40 minutes. Oh my god. I'm sorry, guys, but you know, <laughs> doubters. No, don't call them dumb. That's mean. <laughs> but yeah, they are kind of dum. Yeah, chatters. Um, our next sub goal stream is gonna be 50 subs. Is a no cursing Mario Kart stream, which is gonna be crazy. It's gonna be like impossible. Um, but chatters, we have one pre down, two more to go. Let's continue with this run. I mean, looking at the margin in that prediction, it was 99 to 1%. I mean, I I don't discriminate against my believers or doubters, but doubters kind of cringe, not gonna lie. Oh, man, that pre has haunted me for ages. Okay, anybody want to change my character? Anybody want to be nice and give me a light character? Anybody? I was the 1%. <laughs> Yeah, so chatters, um, if we hit 50 subs, then I will do a If I Curse, I Give Subs Mario Kart stream. I 
I am able to not curse, but it's very difficult. So I might throw a few times. Luigi, of course. I knew you'd do it. But thank you for redeeming, Luigi. Yeah, you have to use your channel points, Tanuki. It's only 500, so okay. Finally, look at that. Oh my god. Okay, that was my most difficult pre, and we got it after three tries. It's not that bad. You gotta stay still for 10 minutes. Homie, I sit in this chair all fucking day. I can easily sit still. <coughs> okay, what should we do first? After getting big the bell cup done, these ones seem easy peasy lemon squeezy. <coughs> Let's go ahead and get our first prediction up for this puri. Well, I get first place. Chatter to go gamba. Gamba all your points. Wait, is Cheeseland in this pre? If it is, then that sucks. I hate Cheeseland too. Oh, I should have held. I thought I was in like third or something. Maybe park is too easy? Eh, it's the most difficult part is the items. So you have to be good with your item usage in this track. Oh, there's a blue shell! Somebody passed me! Who's in first? Be second to last lap? How am I still in second? What the fuck? What the frick? Okay, we all got boomed. No, literally, who's in first? Is it Mario, my brother? How could he? I mean, it doesn't matter. I'm the better brother. <laughs> Do not curse. I don't subject myself to child labor to lose literally on all of it. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> no, if I curse, then I give subs. Imagine. I did a stream where the stakes were if chat gives subs, I would get fucking cancelled! <laughs> Peace in the brighter brother. Yep. You right. This <laughs> is a child labor supporter. No. no. Don't be putting words in their mouth. No, 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 no. <laughs> okay, on to the next one. We would riot. If Megan swears someone gets banned. <laughs> now that sounds like a stream I can get behind. I would stop watching, Sedge. See, like, that's why, like, for any stream where there are donation incentives, it's something extra. And it's usually, like, a handicap for me. Um, it's never gonna be, like, a requirement for, like, a paywall for incentives in to that degree. Because I understand a lot of people can't afford to subscribe to everyone, and I totally get it. I know I'm poor myself. Oh, come on! But what if... Wait, we, maybe we could actually do something like that? Where, you know be cool? <laughs> if, um, okay, we're gonna comp this out together. If we do a Mario Kart race, like, tournament, and if you get less- Oh, fuck. If you get top six and above, you're safe, but if you get bottom six, you get timed out for, like, ten minutes. I think that'd be kind of funny. I mean, because, like, a timeout is not, like, a ban. Because I think you can still see the chat room if you're timed out. You just can't type in it. I think something with that type of concept would be interesting. Oh my god. <sighs> <laughs> I 
I fell off. I'm in sixth place, guys. I would get timed out. <laughs> because, like, I think with those type- if we're ever gonna do, like, a challenge of that type, I feel like chatters would all have to agree if they're gonna participate. Like, I don't want anybody bitching that they got timed out for, like, ten minutes. You know, I don't want any hurt feelings, I don't want any chatters going home and crying to their moms. You know, I don't want you to talk to your principal and said, this person online was a meanie to me. Pusho! There's like no notification! I never see it! Oh, save, hold. Okay. But I'm so close! Oh, that's a horde, but you know. Still a W. Wait, Mac, I thought you said I will sub. <laughs> I was like, cool. <clears throat> yeah, because, like, I know for the tournament streams, um, we're probably just going to do, like, challenges with mechanics in the game for now. But I kind of want to think of more, like, unique, obscure things. So. I would tell my principal, counselor, dad, mom, and all nine of my siblings. Dude, okay, that's kind of scary. I do feel... A little bit threatened by that. The, is anybody parent? Is anybody's parent like a teacher or like a principal? I used to forge my dad's signature for stuff. Okay, Mac, don't be self-reporting. You know, you can say I might have used to forge, but don't, <laughs> don't, don't self-report. <laughs> Hacker men's, we're on it. Okay, Chatter's new game is up. New prediction. <clears throat> A deputy principal? Is that a thing? Is that like the vice principal or a principal in training? I've never heard the term deputy principal. Is that a EU thing? Any EU viewers? Can you vouch? I think I might have only, maybe might have, signed um, a field trip form with my signature, let's say. Because it was in my backpack and we had to get it signed over the weekend and I went back to school and I was like, shit, it's not signed. So, and my mom's signature, like she has a real signature, but her signature that she used for like school paperwork used to be literally just a squiggle. Because she has like, she, her hands got damaged at work. So her, it hurts for her to write. So she literally just does a squiggle. So let me just say it was... it might Okay, it might have been very easy to copy. <laughs> I'm not saying I did, but maybe it happened to like other kids or something. Who's, maybe their mom's signatures were very easy and like a simple squiggle. Yeah, I agree. This is this part right here, like this kind of turquoisey, like light blue green section, is super pretty. Definitely one of my favorites, like visually. I like the wood too. Oof. First place, easy. How many cups do I have left? I have one more after this one, so this is our second to last cup. Yeah, I feel like most everybody has signed paperwork at least once, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> In front of the teacher, Nick, you're crazy. That's actually crazy. I mean, not not crazy. I, I say, okay. I use crazy too casually, and I know it's not... That's not a word you should use lightly. But... That's brazen. Let, let's change crazy to brazen. You're right, if they did add flowers in the water, it'd be so cute. Imagine if you're driving through and the petals, like, flutter up in the air. Yeah, I don't think our parents had to ever, like, sign a report card. Because I, I think they would just get mailed to us. Hey, chatters. This is the final race of this pre. This is another pre we've been grinding for months for that three star. And we're gonna get an easy dub. We got daytime. Usually the best mode for this track. 
it's not off. We have a bright daytime mode. See, out of all my signatures... Wait, okay, Chatters, I have a question. Did any of you guys who are younger learn cursive in school? Because I know for me, I graduated in like 2017 for high school. And there were some kids who didn't learn cursive. I know for me, I learned cursive when I was in 4th grade. We had like 30 minutes of cursive lessons every day for 3 months. And we had a little notebook. And I love cursive, I think it's really pretty, it looks artsy. Very expressive as well. And it's crazy to me, because I think they stopped teaching cursive in our district like 2 years after I took it. So all the kids who are graduating now probably didn't learn cursive. And cursive is mandatory for signatures, right? So there are people like signing checks and paperwork who haven't even learned cursive. That's crazy to me. Blue shell, of course, of course! Do a handwriting classes in primary? Well, you're EU. I'm talking to my American frogs. <laughs> Hi, Chris. Welcome to stream. Hope we're doing well today. You've never learned it, really? It it's sad to think that people don't learn it because I feel like it's so essential. And it's a lot. Oh my god! It's a lot easier to write, like, the flow in which your letters move. It, it's so much easier. Come on, Mario, don't. What happened? Like, what happened? I, I had it, and then I didn't have it? You just learned how to write your signature? Yeah, we learned like the whole alphabet. That's like the the calligraphy that we do at End of Stream is very similar to cursive. Um, it's not as like curly. It's definitely more expressive than traditional cursive. But <sighs> guys, we gotta do this one again. Okay, honestly, this pre is not as bad. It's not as bad. Oh, Chris, I forgot to ask. If you have any preferred nicknames or pronouns, make sure to tell me. <sighs> the music describes your mood. Well, I'm not very happy right now. Wait, no! Guys, look at our prediction. We had 10 points in doubt. Oh, no. And we had 1k in belief. Who got it? Who got it? Who got all those points? Damn. Damn. Doubters are up 1k. I think that was one person. Shit. Look, it's a two star. It was you, hacker? Damn. I mean, I think deserved, honestly. If anybody, I'd want it to go to hacker, okay? <laughs> okay, let's go again. Anybody want to change my character? Anybody want to change it? <laughs> Chatters, if you're gonna change my character, please keep it light. Luigi was a perfect build. You're gonna look? No problem. No problem. We can race together. <laughs> Anybody wanna change my character? I was so close on that pre, though, honestly. <laughs> Have you redeemed already today, Decon? If so, that could be why. Making his favorite viewers confirmed. Okay. No, I... No, that's not... No. Gold Peach, thank you, Nyx. That's my favorite. Nyx is a wholesome chatter today. We love that. Yeah. <laughs> it says check back next stream. Oh, okay. Oh, someone else redeemed it. <laughs> Gotta be quicker, Decon. <laughs> Okay, let's try again. Yeah, Chatters, you can only redeem it once per stream. That's so we can avoid people like Mac, Decon, or Issa who are just going to spam Wario the whole time. So, <laughs> why? <laughs> because, like I said, I don't want people to spam. It's annoying. Like, if, if we keep Gold Peach for, like, three more pre's, I would be happy. <laughs> I'm a good chatter, Copium. <laughs> Hey, Chatters, go Gamba, go Gamba. Okay, I am playing my favorite character. I am really good at handling Peach. We're gonna win this one, guys. We got so close last time, we're gonna win. We're gonna get a dub. 
Just for chat. And lurkers. I used to think it was weird to call, um... I guess the group of people watching chat. Because I used to call people guys, or like, blood like, where you're like, BOYS! Like that type of thing. But I think chat is, I guess, the best name. Because the people who I'm interacting with is the chat room, right? Even though the people who are lurking are still here, they're still a part of the stream. I feel like chat is the best name for them. Because, like, you know, we don't have, like, a name for the viewers yet. Like, what what was it? <laughs> um, because, like, Megan Peason, right? What 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 could we call ourselves, chatters? Anybody have any, any ideas what we could call ourselves? <clears throat> no, of course. Oh, wait, wait, pause, hold. That banana might have saved us right there. Maybe not. Peepees. <laughs> no, we're not. We're not calling you guys peepees. We're not calling you peepees. Peace innies. Peace outies. Peacemakers. Okay. I think peacemakers is kind of cool. The Meg. Wait, Meg Meisters. That's too long. It's gotta be kind of shorter. It's gotta be shorter. Again. <laughs> we're gonna go again. I like the peepees. No, we're not. We're not. We're not doing peepees. No, chatters. No, we're not. This is a 13 plus stream. We're not doing peepees. Meg Minions. I think Meg Minions is kind of funny. <laughs> really? The stats for Gold Peach is bad? Really? Huh? I like it. I think this skin is cool. PP. <laughs> no. No. PP is bad, okay? I don't want to get banned. I don't want... Not banned off the platform, but, like, banned from chatters. Okay, let's go again. We're gonna try again. Again! Peacers? Like, peace and then ER. Peacers? <laughs> Chat is so funny. Sure. <laughs> Honestly, you guys are pretty good. You guys got some bangers sometimes. No, come on, come on. I need protection. Oh, getting a triple banana in first? That's kind of rare. Yeah, I agree, Raven. The stats don't matter as long as you queue. All the people going to cosplay conventions with their big-ass costumes, as long as you queue, if it slows you down, don't matter. <laughs> okay! We boom the blue shell. Easy clap. Still, there's like no notification for it ever. What is going on? Is my game hacked? Am I getting glitched? Wait, I meant to say, is my game glitched? Am I getting hacked? I mixed up. I'm gonna cosplay Meg to anime NYC. What would you even dress up as? Like, what, what what would my cosplay be? Okay, poofy hair, glasses. Um. <laughs> what what else could it be? You were close. What? <laughs> huh? Well, you know, I won that one. We are back on track. Another W. W's only today. Oh, yeah, the Pikachu on the chair. A bike helmet? Huh? Wait. Rose Gold Peach is heavier? Heavier than them? What the fuck? Really? Huh? It doesn't seem like she'd be heavier, though. I mean... I do consider 
wearing my helmet when I go inside. Cause you know, I need protection. I gotta protect the big brain of mine. I don't know about y'all, but I always carry a first aid kit whenever I go out. Especially when I go out to ride my bike, cause I usually carry a mini backpack, just in case. Cause you know, you never know what's gonna happen. It's not a full first aid kit, like it's a mini one. But if you- it's got like antiseptic wipes, a few bandages and band-aids. I've considered carrying pepper spray, but I feel like I would fuck up and then spray myself in the face, and that's not gonna help. Because <laughs> I think when you spray pepper spray, like, it, it lingers in the air. Like, you have to be shooting from quite a bit of distance for it to, like, not affect you as well, yeah? Blue shell? Okay, well, I spun out on purpose there, maybe? Yeah, if I had a car, I definitely would have a full first aid kit. I'd have a tool set, too. Even though I don't know how to use tools. Like, if my car broke down, I could still have them. That way, if somebody came up to me and, like, they knew how to use tools, they could help me. Because <laughs> in my head, even when I go out, like, normally, I always carry, like, snacks and water in my backpack. Because I know whenever I go with my friends, they're gonna get hungry or need water, so it's like, I'm gonna be prepared for them. I fucked up! Oh no, oh no, come on, come on. Oh, I, I have a huge lead, I'm fine, I'm fine. I thought I was screwed, but you know, it's fine. <laughs> if you get a car, just get AAA, not sponsored. Hashtag, not an ad. Okay, well that's another dub, guys. Decon, that is not the strat. That is not. Chatters, don't take Decon's advice. Decon is gonna get hit by a car one day. Hopefully not, though, but if you're gonna be out walking at night, I know you're trolling. I know you're trolling. But make sure you're wearing, like, something bright. Yeah, literally. Like, my family is, like, we're not too close, but if we ever need something, like, we'll be there. Sorry, Decon, I'm not laughing at your trauma dumping, but... BRB, okay, shit, good luck, Mac. Or not Mac, I, me I meant to say Nyx. But good luck, hope everything is okay. <laughs> I am not laughing at your trauma, Decon, but... <laughs> that, that is... Scary. <laughs> oh, I hate riding my bike through residential areas. Like, I used to ride my bike around, like, the corner. But I, I go out and bike to a trail now. Because, like, there's so many people who don't even look when they're getting out of their driveways, too. And, like, it's not worth- <laughs> It's not worth getting it! Because, like, I'll either go biking in the morning or, like, in the afternoon. So, like, right when people are leaving for work and then people are coming home. So, I, I gotta be extra careful and, like, alert when I'm out and about. Whose water is bussin'? Honey, you should not be drinking water from the hose. Yes, you may be getting more vitamins from the dirt, but other than that, don't, don't do that. <laughs> it's probably just as bad as drinking from a public watering fountain. But, like, okay, honestly, probably not as bad because you probably won't get hepatitis from a, from a hose. But think about all the bugs that have crawled in, all the dirt. I mean, that could be, I guess, extra flavor. It is busting chatter. What is wrong with you guys? Are you guys that thirsty? Huh? You can use drinkable water any source, really? Oh. Well, that's kinda cool though. That's why you let him run for a second. <gasps> no. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, don't do that. Chatters, if you're from UK, I guess it's fine, but if you're from the States, don't drink from the hose, okay? Decon's an EU viewer Andy. 
Oh wait, hacker asked if you anybody's drinking hose water. <laughs> no, I would I literally would never do the hacker. I would go inside and get a cup of water. Okay, chat, we are here again. Ooh, we got night mode. Ooh, scary. Yeah, I saw your message, Luigi. Chatters, don't... If I don't read it out loud, I still read it. I just don't acknowledge verbally every message. Because if I did, I'd be talking all day and it'd be boring. But Chatters, this is our last race of the pre -wear. Here again. Can I do it? Can I get a first place and finally get that three star? I think I can do it. The snowmen are not ideal because this is another projectile to dodge, but you know, we can handle it. We can do it. Easy clap, we got Link. Maybe Aurora's cheering me on. Anybody see her? Ooh, you guys see that? I blasted that snowman. She doesn't want to talk to us. No, it's not that. No, I'm not capping. Oh, wait, you guys see that? Okay, I threw the red shell. But they have protection, and then they got clapped by a green. Nice try. No, no, no. This is bad, this is bad. This is really bad. This is horrible. Please, I don't want to do this free again. Keep back in first. We have a red shell in case anybody passes us. Fucking dumbass Wendy. Didn't hold a binder. My lines are better than you guys. Get fucked. me at the end was a character and I almost like fucking screamed. <coughs> but guys, look at that. That is finally the three star gold trophy has been I was gonna say achieved, but retrieved? Received? Won? We get excited you almost threw up. No, it's <laughs> it's um <laughs> I, 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 I scream, but my folks don't like when I scream, so I have to, like, cover up. <laughs> I threw up. <laughs> Guys, look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Again, I never won. Another one. <laughs> Tell your folks to buzz off. Okay. I mean, they are more supportive of the stream now, so. Okay. Guys, we are nearly two hours into stream. But. Wait, anybody want to change my character real quick? We are heading into the final pre. The final one before I get all three Dargo trophies in 200. <laughs> Anybody want to change it? <clears throat> okay, too late. <laughs> it's still not working for you. Did you already redeem today, Econ? You did not redeem? Try refresh your tab. That could be it. It's making me mad. You can't either- well you already did today, Butler. Let's see who redeemed. Let's see, we, we had Butler, Nyx, 
Raven, Mac, Luigi. So, Decon, try refresh your tab if that could be the issue. Oh, wait, no! I don't want to do this one. Okay. We are getting ready. For the final three that I have yet to get a three-star gold trophy in. Chatters, first prediction is up. <clears throat> Maybe next time, for next time we do Mario Kart, I'll cap the change my character to twice the string. <laughs> I'm glad you're... Or, I'm glad I'm your favorite TikToker, Nyx. I, I love being known as a TikToker. Okay, the first one is usually super difficult for me, but honestly, not that bad. Actually crushing today. We have protection against any blues on track. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> yeah, I agree. I used to hate Dragon Driftway, but now I kind of like it. Like, some of the lines are still kind of difficult in it, but I don't mind it as much. Did you hear about the guy who released a million frog eggs? No, I didn't. Is that... Can you league... Can you legally do that? So at that point, if you release a million eggs, is, wouldn't that be considered like a, a hugely invasive species? Give me something, give me something! No! I have a banana, but I threw it ahead! Like a dumbass! It's 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 too late. It, I don't know if I can get back. Bye, hacker. We'll see you next time, honey. Oh no, this is bad. This is really bad. Get third second. Yeah, I want that double item box. Got it. But how she passed me. My lines are better, you fell in the grass like a dummy. Easy clap. If you doubt I fight. <laughs> no, 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 no. No. Doubters can choose how people can vote however they want to vote. They do have their democratic right to vote. Or gamba. <laughs> okay. I think in this pre. Yoshi Circuit and then Dragon Driftway are my most difficult ones. So if I did decent on Yoshi, I think I should be fine. Okay, Excite Bike is a toss-up. It, it can go either way. I didn't doubt. Doubting is cringe. I know. Doubting is cringe. Okay, new prediction. See, I get what you're saying, Decon. Like, I know when I was younger, biting my fingers and my fingernails was a huge problem. Looking back, it was probably, like, um, undiagnosed anxiety, because I still do it to this day. But, as some chatters know, I do paint my nails every week, so that way I don't bite my nails, because I'm like, if I bite my nails, I ruin my, my nail polish that I spend an hour on. Um, because I know when I was little, my parents would try and put Tabasco on my fingertips, but that didn't work, even though, like, I hate spicy food. I would still like do it because with those type of bad coping mechanisms and those bad habits it's very easy or it's very difficult to break. It's just one of those things where you have to recognize when it's happening and then you have to try and stop it in the moment. Cuz nail biting for me definitely was something I just did casually and I didn't realize I was doing it. But once I kind of pinpointed I guess the circumstances in which I started biting my nails 
because I noticed I would I would only bite them if I got bored, like if I didn't have like a fidget thing in my hand, or if I got anxious. So I think that's the first step to try and combat it. Like it's definitely something that will take time to get over. So don't be too discouraged if you're not successful with stopping that habit right away. We're doing good. We got a first. We just got inked. I can't see! First place! Easy. Do I actually have a PGP combo? What is that? Because, like, I personally like my bike build. Like, it took a while to figure out which build gave me the most acceleration. Because I think with my bike and wheel combo, I think it's the best acceleration I can get. Because I know for me, I don't necessarily care as much about, like, handling or traction. Like, as long as I can get that first, like, big boost at the start of the race and, like, be able to gain acceleration throughout the race, that's what my priorities are. You never bite your nails, but you bit the skin around your nails? Really? See, whenever I run out of nails, that's when I bite the skin. Anyway. <laughs> Chatters go gamba. <laughs> it's definitely like one of those topics where it's like some things will work for some and then some won't for others. Like, I know for me the main overarching problem was just my anxiety that wasn't handled properly when I was younger. Because even now, my parents just learn, like, what anxiety is. But, like, looking at their behaviors in the past, they've definitely experienced it, but didn't realize that's what it was. Because they're the type of people to think that mental illness is a you problem. They don't necessarily think it's, like, a... Like, I guess a chemical problem, because I know for most mental illness, it, it comes down to, like, your actual, like, your chemical makeup in your brain. So you can't really help it sometimes. Like, some people are just wired that way. But there are ways to, like, diminish your symptoms of it. And, like, learn, like, positive coping mechanisms. Oh! Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> no! <laughs> no, I knew it was gonna hit! Dude, I fell off from second to fifth. What happened? Okay, this is the worst item in the whole game. But, you know, eating people is a little bit fun. A little bit. <laughs> Not cool all the time, but still pretty fun. Oh my god! Okay, we're fine. We're good. We're good. What? Okay, I didn't realize you can get infections on your finger from that. Oh wait, actually, now that I think about it. Your fingers? Like, that touches the most surfaces, right? So, I, if you get one bad germ in there, I can see- Oh, yeah, I can see how infection can happen then. Chatters, don't bite your fingers. Maybe doubting isn't that cringe. No, I had it, Raven. I clutched at the end. <laughs> I don't think I've ever had an infection, thankfully. Like, I've been lucky. So anytime I've gotten a scrape or a cut, we clean it up right away. Thankfully, I haven't had any two major injuries as well. Oh, PGP is pink old peach. Okay, thank you, Luigi. I was like, is this, like, some new terminology? Because, like, I'm into Mario Kart, but I'm not into, like, like the hardcore logistics of it. I, like, I know I need to get into it. Hey, chatters. This is our first attempt at this pre for the day. We are on track. Wait, no. 
might be the second attempt. I forgot if I didn't win or lose the first time. Um, but this track isn't that bad. And we can maybe even try to go for the skip at the end. Okay, I ran into the wall. Did I go for the skip? There we go! Oh, look at that shit! That was perfect! Not as fast, but you know, really good skip right there. When I first saw that skip, it blew my mind! I didn't get it! I wasted the boom box. I threw. I'm not going for the skip because the red shell is approaching. Not worth. Okay, we got one on the box. It's fine. Bruh. They threw that one just for me. I feel like they're stream sniping. Hey, come on. I can do this first try. Yeah, this is our first time doing the spray, I think, today, yeah? So I don't think we've played... Really? I got squished. I don't think we've played this track today yet. Fuck you. You first. Let's go for the skip again. Oh! I almost fell off! <laughs> Sorry, I saw your message, Nezra, and it's funny. Guys, look at that. Okay, let's look at that trophy. We did it, question mark? Yeah, we did it. And just about at the two hour mark, too. I genuinely thought this would take longer, but you know, we did it. Well, you did it. I know. I was just going to say that. <laughs> I was like, actually. It was all me, baby. Wait, look, let's, look, let's look at this. Do I actually have a good combo? I think so. Like, I think it's pretty solid. But guys, look at that. Wait. No. I forgot about the DLC tracks. Oh no. They them? Okay, Decon. No problem. I forgot about the DLC tracks! Okay, well, this run isn't over. God damn it. I thought. I need to. No! Look at the title. I can't clickbait. It says stream ends when I get all three stars. Anybody want to change my character? Let me see if I can actually change that setting. Damn. That sucks. Hey, okay, welcome back, Lorenzo. Okay, I'm changing the character redemption to where I can do more than once a stream. Let's do three. Okay, chatters, is it updated? <clears throat> Super troop? Okay. We'll, we'll start off with that one. So, chatters, I changed the redemption to up to three times per day. Damn, I thought we were done. <laughs> That's what you get for Danny. Well, you know who else is done? The people who are non-subs, you're gonna get an ad. <laughs> okay, I, I don't know what, what the context of done means in that situation, but guys, we are about two hours into stream. And you guys know what time it is. It is time for me to run a few minutes of ads, but you can avoid that ad break by subscribing for just five four ninety nine, just five dollars. Skip your coffee today and get ad previewing all month long. Or if you have an Amazon Prime, link it to your Twitch account, get a free Amazon Prime sub every month. 
So chatter, stick around. We're gonna continue with this run. We're gonna keep going until we get that three star in the Lucky Cat Cup. I thought we were done, but we are not done. So chatter, stick around. Get some water, get a snack if you need it. We will see some of you guys in a few. Imagine not doing the, the DLC. I know, right? I thought I had it. I thought I had it. Um, I'm not sure why it's not working. Decon, if it's an issue, it could be a glitch with the actual Twitch website. So, that could be the problem. If it persists after today, I would recommend contacting Twitch support. Anyway, because there's, there's nothing I can do on my end. If it works for everybody else and not you, then it's probably a glitch. Or a server issue. <laughs> Dude, I'm not, I'm not shilling Spotify. I'm shilling Twitch subs. Since it's not working for your decon, I'll do Pink Yoshi if we have to try this pre again. Only if. Okay. All these tracks are easy. Wait. It has Ninja Hideaway and the car one, doesn't it? Damn. Damn, damn, damn. We'll, we'll see how this... We'll see how many tries this one takes. This track is really easy, though. This one is easy clap. Easy dub. No way I don't get last. Oh, wait. No way I don't get first. <laughs> <laughs> but you know we're gonna we're gonna beat this on first try. We're gonna do it. Cause you know I am good at this game. When I played this track offline with my sister and her friend, I was like a solid half a lap ahead of them the whole time. It was crazy. Oh, are you sure, Decon? Well, that's really sweet. You know, being fair. Hopefully it gets resolved. Like I said, if it keeps persisting, then contact Twitch support. Because there's usually, like, a lot of glitches. With, like, little stuff. Sometimes. Oh my god! Lightning Bolt number 11, right, guys? <laughs> can we redeem in advance? You can! But what if we actually beat it the on the first try, then you're wasting your points? Hmm. And I honestly might forget, Nyx. <laughs> Because you, you <gasps> no. Okay, well we are resetting already. So if chatters, you want to change my character, do it now. God damn it! On the easiest track. Man, one percenters eating good this time. God, of course the easiest one. What happened at the end there? Oh, I got bolted and then I lost my items. Uh, okay, let's go again. Pink Yoshi? Okay, next. Oh, you're so cute. Redeeming it for Decon. Aw. Okay. Let's go again. God. I... Okay. I know I said Bell Cup was gonna be the most difficult, but this one might take a while, too. Oh, my God. I just want to eat cookies. Can we just... Time travel like an hour so I can eat my cookies. <laughs> okay. Hey, Chatter's new prediction is up. Will I get first? Go Gamba. Exact shit is pink. I become when I sit in the sun. See, I'm one of the lucky few to where if I go out in the sun, I don't get burnt. I just get a light tan. I am so lucky. Oh my god, because like it was two weekends ago, right? Where I went out to harvest lavender and I got a little bit burnt. Like you can't even see my tan lines anymore. And like I'm wearing a tank top today too. I'm just like a little bit brown. If I get scared by bananas in a Mario Kart game, I generally don't think I can handle a scary game. Isn't Mario Kart Tour the mobile game? 
I've never played it. I think hackers said they've played it. Oh, hackers not in chat, Sag. <laughs> I burn if I make eye contact with light. <laughs> Easy dub. I I think the RNG was just bad the last race because no way I could have not gotten first. Hey chat, new prediction is up. Go Gamba. You think? Okay, I don't know. I genuinely don't know how this track will go. I am not good at this one. Dodging the cars is very difficult at 200, but I will try my best. You know what? At least the first track of this pre isn't that bad. It kind of butters you up, makes you think you're good at this pre. And then this one is just a punch in the face. You know what's nice though is that at least no cars are like driving towards you because I feel like that'd be ten times scarier. You know, we're in the flow of traffic. We're being the little degenerate teenagers who race on the highway at 10 p.m. every night. But we're on bikes and carts. But people, if you're gonna be racing on the highway, just don't do that. It is so dangerous. There, there's been so many times where I'm out driving at night and I see people pulled over. Like, where their cars crunched. And they're all, like, younger people who I can only assume are speeding or, like, racing. And it's like, just don't do it. It's not- it's not worth it. Like, your life is so important. You should be extremely careful. Oh my god! You should be careful when you're driving. <laughs> and it's not a game. Like, you shouldn't treat life like a game. Hi, Pneumonia. Welcome to stream. Hope we're doing well today, hun. Oh! Okay, that one was way too tight. That one was impossible. No! No way he did that. Actually stream sniping. Shit! <laughs> yeah, I'm doing pretty good today, Pneumonia. I appreciate you asking. Today's been good. Hi, MJ. Welcome to stream. We're pretty well today. Oh, okay, MJ. I had a question for you. Do you want to be called Mike or MJ? Because Katie was calling you Mike, and I was like, huh? Because I don't think you ever told me your nickname. Or I don't know if you care. <laughs> yeah, it's crazy. I got a first there. No way the cars go towards me in Miramoto. That'd be insane. That'd be crazy. I've never played Miramoto on this track, I don't think, yet. Wait, no. I don't- I don't- Wait, I know I have. My key? Okay, I'll do my key. I think it's cuter. I don't think they go towards you. Yeah, I don't think they go towards you. I don't know. I want to do a stream where I just do mirror mode. Wait. Wait. Hi, Lord of Dead. Welcome to stream. Hope we're doing well. <laughs> oh, wait, wait. What? Chatters, new Gamba's up. What if? You know how they sell, like, those drunk goggles? Where you put them on and it kind of distorts your vision? What if we did that while I was playing mirror mode? Dude, that would be crazy, though. But I, I generally feel like I would throw up if I did that stream. <laughs> Please do that? Okay. May maybe, maybe. Maybe we can make that a, a sub goal stream. Because that does not... It sounds like a fun idea for Chad, but not for me. <laughs> like, that would have to be a challenge where... 
um, I would do for like maybe 30 minutes. Because like, there's a reason why I've never played a VR game. Like, even just like watching like the 360 videos on like YouTube or something, those make me queasy. Sounds like I get last every time? Probably, honestly. I mean, doubters would be eating good for that stream. <laughs> Oh my god! Thank you for the gift in tier 1, Deacon! I appreciate that! Hey, child labor, I know, right? Pretty pog you. But thank you! You're gonna get your name originally in the stream! Guys, I have such a massively- look at that! Oh my god! Okay. Now it is time for the dreaded ninja hideaway. We can't run away from it for much longer. We have done pretty good so far, though. We've gotten three solid first in a row. We will see. Your chatter's prediction is up, go Gamba. Do you think I will get first? Or do you think I will lose? <laughs> yeah. If I'm never gonna play a, a horror game, I would literally never ever play a horror VR game. Like, I don't wanna shit my pants, you know what I mean? Cause like, I think when, when we're talking about like horror games or movies, I think the thing that scares me the most is not necessarily the jump scares. Yes, I do jump, I do flinch. But the psychological horrors, where they're like based off of true stories, and it's usually people just being like psychopathic, and like they see normal, but they do like crazy shit. Like that to me is crazy. Like that scares me the most. Okay, I've done pretty good so far. I don't have too big a lead, but it's still... We got a first. God, the age rating was so close, so I didn't think it'd be scary. I mean, like, I've watched a few gameplays of the FNAF series, and it seems fine, but I think... Okay, I think it's kind of weird how kids these days are, like, wildly obsessed with scary things, like FNAF. Or, like, horror-type movies. I think it's weird. I mean, it's fine. I think it's okay for people to have their own interests, but... For, like, little 12-year-olds to be obsessed with, like, FNAF is kind of, like, not concerning, but it's, like, why not just, like, watch a cartoon or something? Like, why are you watching scary shit? It's also kind of, like, the people who are, like, weirdly obsessed with true crime. It's, like, I get it's interesting, but, like, it, it's, <laughs> it's scary shit that they're talking about. I didn't have a lot of confidence in myself for that race, and appears chat did it either. It was a 30-70 margin. But, look at that! I got a dub! We got a 3-star on the first try? Huh? You're lurking? Okay. It's okay. Don't feel obligated to share, Mac, but it'll be okay. Feel free and chill here. We'll stay positive and hype for you. I love getting freaked out and having scary dreams because when I wake up, I feel alive. Okay, it appears pneumonia is one of those people who was obsessed with horror when they were younger. I mean, that's fine. But... I- okay. I've never felt good after waking up from a nightmare. <laughs> like, it's not a good time. Dude, look at that! Three star on the first try? Holy shit. Okay, well, thank you, Tanuki. Yeah, I crushed that race. It was crazy. I, I generally didn't think I was going to do well. But, you know, I clutched. Okay, let's look at the lineup again and make sure I didn't miss anything. Oh, wait, I did battle. <laughs> Certified to the light moment. I know. 
Well, look in the chat, Lord of Dead. If you have any preferred nicknames or pronouns, make sure to tell me. Okay, so we got the two DLC. Oh, look at that. One more time. Look at that. All three stars and 200 CC. Oh, I have none in mirror mode. I have literally none. Oh, I don't have them all in 150? Interesting. I thought I did. Okay. Hmm. Well, not in 100 either. But, you know, the title says 200 CC trophy. So, you know, we got three stars and all 200. I think 200 is the most difficult. Okay, so chat. Let's see. This went shorter than I thought it would. I generally thought it would take me a bit longer. So, we do have time for Animal Crossing today. So... If you're new to stream how Animal Crossing works, it's usually a bit more chill, more just chat vibes, because I, I don't necessarily have to be focused on the screen the whole time. So, stick around, guys. I'm gonna go ahead and switch out the game cartridge. Yeah, thank you, Raven. Thank you guys for sticking through me the whole time for that. Like, I know I took some L's, but, you know, I got a good handful of W's that time. I was the only one that believed in you that race, really? Well, I appreciate that. Because, you know, I was I didn't believe in myself, but you know, I still won. Because it is important to stay positive, guys. Being positive is key. Okay. <laughs> I like watching you play because you suck at Nintendo games, really? I suck at literally every day, every other game, except for Nintendo. <laughs> this stream could have lasted for five hours. Yeah, truly, literally, <laughs> literally. Okay, what should we change our title to? I'll never find her. <laughs> now, don't say that, Decon. Remember, staying positive. Don't say that. Because when you have one negative thought, it you spiral. What <laughs> about? Okay, I guess you're joking. <laughs> I really I was watching back a VOD from the other day at like 1.5 speed and I realized my normal like speaking voice I talk really quickly so I'm sorry guys if you guys miss some things that I say Okay. It was half J, Sag. Well, you know, you gotta stay positive and acknowledge what you are good at. And focus on those. And if you have shortcomings, try to identify ways in which you can change that behavior. But chat, it's while we're waiting for the game to load. Um, I'm gonna upload a new TikTok. So if you aren't already, go follow my TikTok. I love fast talkers make me more in tune. I agree. I, I feel like people who talk fast, you have to pay attention the whole time. You like TikTok is uploading, guys? <laughs> it's the emo kangaroo. Yes, I do not like them. Oh, wait, guys. I have a few things to show you. In game. In, in game. <laughs> Oh, you got a hobby? You sketch stuff? That's great! I mean, going out, taking pictures, and drawing them? Pretty good. They stole Isabel from Marco. Yeah, they yoinked her. Okay, chatters, that new TikTok is up. Go watch it. Go like it. Go leave a comment. Okay. Let's get started. Name this stream to Animal Crossing Vibes. I'm never gonna name my title that because that is boring as all hell. Because chatters, I want you to think. Use your content brain. <laughs> Would you click on a stream that doesn't sound hype? Because I feel like most of you guys like hype streams. That's why I like I click bait my title a lot. Like I know me as a viewer, I would never click on something that said chill stream. Cause I would like I don't I don't want to chill. <clears throat> okay, enough stalling. 
Hello there, everyone. Right now in Timbaland, it is 1.14 p.m. on Tuesday, July 5th, 2022. Oh! I just- <gasps> Guys, CG is here! Sorry, I got excited. Oh, I just heard that CG is visiting Timbaland today. It sounds like he's just here to relax, but I heard he's always interested in buying fish if you have any to sell. And with that, I'll get back to work supporting you and your enjoyment of our island. Yeah, I, 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 that's how I consume Twitch now too, Pneumonia Lake. I just only look at my following list because I think the big reason why people like Twitch and like specifically Twitch streams is because they like the personality. Like it's very rare that I will watch a new person playing Mario because I don't know their personality. I don't know their vibes. Like I have to know the personality before I watch the stream. That's why like a lot of people I watch on Twitch, I usually watch their YouTube and that's what brought me here. Like all you guys, Majority of you guys, I would have to say like 99% of you guys found me from TikTok. Not a lot of people found me on Twitch. So, like it does take a lot of effort and time to like make um, plat or make content on other platforms. But it's definitely a lot more effective on bringing people to your actual stream. <clears throat> okay, so Janice, I have a few things to show you. Because last time we played it was Friday, right? The first order of business. Upcoming fishing tourney on Saturday, July 9th, our island fishing tourney takes place. There are wonderful prizes if you earn a lot of points. I hope you're looking forward to like it too I am. So chatters, if you looked at my Twitch schedule, I added an extra bonus stream on Saturday. Because how could we not how can we afford to miss watching? The best fisherman to ever live, which is me. My PB for fishing tourneys is a solid 10. So I think I could beat that PB on Saturday. My goal is to get 11, maybe 12. Wait, is that right? Yeah, that's right. It's flipped for me. <laughs> so, Chatters, we are doing an extra stream on Saturday. I don't know what time, but it's open from 9 to 6 p.m. It's probably going to be same time, 11. Just depends on what time I get up. It might be earlier. It might be later. I don't know. I'm feeling crazy that day, so. <laughs> I appreciate that, Lord. Lord of Dead. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> it's kind of sus saying D-E-D. -E Can I say D-E-D? -E Lord of D-E-D? -E <laughs> but, yeah, I, I definitely agree with you on that. Same thing you said, Pneumonia. Like, the platform, I think... Not that it's going in a bad direction. But... Sometimes... you. Because, like, watching streams for a long period of time, you're investing your time into the person. So, it takes a lot for me to sit down and watch an hour stream for someone I don't know. Um, but I appreciate the people who don't come in a stream. If you come in here just once to check it out, that's totally fine. It might not be for you, and that's okay. Because I know stream content is not for everyone. Um, what was the other thing I was gonna show? Oh, yeah. Um, we got our new villager, because last Friday, we, um, we searched for Aurora. We didn't find her. I said I was gonna try and find her offline. But the next day, we got a new villager. So let's go talk to her real quick. <laughs> when was Animal Crossing at Gordon Ramsay cooking show, or the stream said? Um, we're doing that next Sunday. So Sunday, the 17th, I'm gonna have people come to my island, and we're gonna have a cooking competition. It will be announced on Twitter this week. So, Chatters, if you aren't already, go follow my Twitter. And I will have a formal announcement there later this week. No, oh, but guys, look! Isn't she cute? We got a penguin, surprisingly. This was, like, the random RNG villager. Friga. Friga? Friga. But yeah, she's cute, right? She's cute. You know, it's not Aurora, but still another penguin. The RNG gods, I guess, feel bad for me and gave me a penguin still. So, I think that's pretty cool. <laughs> hmm, what is it? You're watching me so intently, it's a bit unnerving. What you doing? Well, you see, I'm working on a palm tree lamp. It's a DIY crafting project, my dear. Oh! Is she like one of those, okay, not frou-frou, but... Like the super, like, proper... I was daydreaming, you see, and the design came to me. Then, just like that, I made it happen. I know, why don't you try making a palm tree lamp, too? It's really quite exciting, and I'd be more than happy to teach you how. I know all the tricks. I know, she's cute! 
Wait, Deacon, I thought you said tastes like a grandma. And I was like, huh? What? That's the spirit. Good for you. I've written down the recipe, so do please take it with you. Yeah, I don't have dyslexia, but sometimes I, I... It's not that I read words... The letters don't mix up, but I assume the wrong word that I'm reading. <laughs> Yummy grandma. <laughs> no, we don't... We, we're not We're not gonna eat people. <laughs> no. But we are gonna be eating cookies later. But we're not eating grandmas. No, no. No, no. <laughs> Oh wait, okay, the other thing is I got the cutscene to where um, Rooster will come to my island, so let's go ahead and do this first. But first I need to actually get some axes. I forgot. It's all in Gretel core. <laughs> oh, I think... I don't think cannibalism would be allowed on any platform. I, I think you would you would get banned and put on a watch list. No, so we're we're not we're not gonna do that. <laughs> no, no, we're not doing that. Not here. Not today. Not ever. Why did I say not today? Taking stream, but people <laughs> wait. If we did a, a gingerbread cookie stream for Christmas, that'd be a great title. Somebody write that down. That's a great title. <laughs> Shadows, write it down. Baking stream, but people. Wait, wait, wait. It could be baking people, but not that type of people. Wait, no, wait. Or, okay. That is actually really bad. Because I just immediately thought of the Holocaust. And I think putting baking people would be really insensitive. Let Chatters, erase it. Don't don't write it down. Erase it. Scratch it out on your paper. Nix it. We're not doing that. <laughs> nope. <sighs> See, it's like... It's one of those things where, you know when you think of a joke, and like, oh, it's good, it's great, but then you might not necessarily understand, like, the other contexts that it could be used in. And then you're like, fuck, spinning away the bad thoughts, yes. Everybody, peace I to spin. Change the subject, please, for the love of God. <laughs> but see, at least I caught it before I actually titled the stream that, you know. I'm at least a little bit aware. Okay. Oh wait, I forgot to show off my fit. This is my uh, Miss Frizzle inspired fit. You know, I'm a school teacher today. I'm getting paid less than livable wages. Yeah, literally, Deacon, literally. <laughs> no, you're fine, Lord, you're fine. <laughs> it's just like, it's one of those times where you think the joke is good, but then when you actually think about it and think about all the different tangents it can go on, you're like, oh, bad joke, bad joke. You're fine. You're fine. I say shit like that sometimes, too. Like, there was one time where, oh my god, it was bad. <laughs> we were looking, I was buying furniture, and there was like a black cello. And I was like, ooh, I don't like that skin. And I was like, fuck! You just need context, and as long as you're aware, of how things can be interpreted, it's fine. Like, as long as it's not done with malintent. <laughs> yeah, chatters, don't self-report. It's fine, we all mess up. We're trolling. And, like, you can tell the people who are actually being hateful or bigoted. Like, there, for certain groups, there are, like, code words they use that I know for the most part, so... Because there's a lot of subtle things on Twitch that people don't realize. But they're like hate groups and that type of thing. So. 
And I would never advocate for platforming those individuals. Whew. Anyway, back to Animal Crossing. <laughs> we got lilies here. Okay, so Brewster should be here. <laughs> I get what you're saying, Nezrin. I usually don't skip the song as much anymore. Oh, because I have such ADD right now where if there's any type of dead air in a game or a video, I'll like open my phone and have like t TikTok or Twitter open because like I can't not be distracted for less than 30 seconds. So usually anytime like he plays a song, I'll like sit down and listen to it. Or like open TikTok and like watch one video as the screen is loading. Yeah, I agree. Like gingerbread cookies, they are fun to make but not fun to eat. Like, I am not a fan of hard cookies. And they don't even taste that good. They're not- Okay, they're not necessarily bitter, but they're not super sweet. Like, if I'm gonna have a cookie, if I'm gonna have some sugar, I want it to be sweet as aisle. Oh my god, the last time we made gingerbread cookies, my sister, like, fucked up the icing ratio. And it was way too liquidy. So even if I tried to, like, ice patterns and designs on it, it would just pool and spill. And I got so mad. Because I think that year, yeah, last year we made all the cookies ourselves, just my sister and I, for the gingerbread ones. Because we usually make, like, five types of cookies and then mail them to, like, relatives and family. But me and my sister were in charge of the gingerbread ones, and I rolled them out, I cut them all out. All she had to do was make the fucking icing, and she messed it up, I got so mad. I mean, when I say mad, I just got agitated, but still, like, all the time that I spent making the actual cookies for her to fuck up the icing, like, the easiest part... It's like, come on, dude. <clears throat> yeah, I think icing and decorating is so fun. Um, I want to, like, learn how to, like, actually use, like, frosting tips and that type of thing. Like, I do have frosting tips in the kitchen. But I know if I try and practice, I'm going to start eating more cookies and cupcakes, and that is not good. I cannot be doing that. The chatters. Um... We do have, I think, 70 subs is one of our long-term sub goals for a cookie decorating stream. So, um, keep that in mind. Because I want to try and, like, actually, for that stream, um, if we do unlock it anytime soon, I would make the cookies so pretty. Like, I'm not going to make them look like dog shit. <laughs> they are going to be, like, you know those super fancy cookies that people charge, like, $10 per cookie? It's going to be on that level. Because I think what I want to do, the idea I've been thinking of, like, you know how you see, like, the mandala designs? Where, um, they put, like, a base color down and then they drip, like, dots of icing of a different color. And then they kind of, like, spread it out to make, like, a mandala pattern. I kind of want to do something like that, but instead of using the icing to make the pattern, I kind of want to place individual sprinkles. That, granted, it would take forever. Huh? Why are you hawing me? <laughs> what, what did I say? That was weird. <laughs> what? Um, yeah, so I think that'd be an interesting way to, like, try and decorate it. I mean, it would be extra as heck. But I think it'd be fun. What am I talking about? I'm talking- we're talking about decorating cookies! You put icing on bread and toast, really? I've never heard that. Oh, there's Brewster! I got excited thinking it was a lost villager, but then I remembered we're not doing that today. <laughs> I've heard- oh wait. Talking about icing on bread, there's this one type of sweet bread where it's not like sliced bread. It's like the super soft, kind of like Hawaiian bread where it's kind of sweet. But then they'll put like butter and sugar on it and it's so good. Is a coconut a nut? I think so, right? No. I don't know. That's one of those things where... That's like one of the weird, wacky facts. 
you hear in like elementary and then you forget it like five minutes later. <laughs> Wait, it's a new bug. Hold. Slowly approach. Easy. <clears throat> a grasshopper? Yeah, okay. Is putting icing on oatmeal cookies normal? Because my mom, she got a pack of oatmeal cookies and it said iced oatmeal cookies. And I was like, huh? I've literally never seen that. So I feel like oatmeal cookies aren't supposed to be super sweet. Because, you know, it's got the raisins in it. That's supposed to be your, your little, like, crumb of sugar. Oh, okay. I see what you're saying, Lord. I see. A one-seeded fruit determines a nut. So then, would a mango be a nut? See, I, I hate these fucking, like, vegetable fruit. Not debates, but I guess clarifications, because there's so many, like, little rules and stuff. Where it's- it, well, I guess it's kind of consistent, so it's kind of like... What determines what a vegetable is, is is if it bears fruit, right? Or, like, bears flowers. But some vegetables flower, and it's confusing. Avocados and nuts. See, it, it's like it makes my brain hurt. I bet if I asked my grandma, she would know because she's a master gardener. And by that, I mean she's just been part of the community garden for 20 years. <laughs> I blame Charles Darwin. <laughs> <coughs> okay, Brewster. You out here looking for gyroids too? You know, Brewster? Do I know a who? Megalon? You're looking at him. Mind if I ask what you're after? Father sent me. I see. I hear you. Tell him that for me. Oh. And also. This is yours if you want it. It's a gyroid fragment. Plant it in the ground. Give it some water and some time. It'll grow up strong the next day. Gyroids take root fast when you return them to the ground. Well then, be seeing you. Okay, well, he, he didn't tell me to tell Blathers anything. So, I think we just gotta go back home. You're back now, no problem. I appreciate you hanging out with us, Giorgio. <laughs> yeah, this is the type of people who start fights over bananas or berries or not. Yeah, it's like one of those debates where it's like, it's so arbitrary and, like, unimportant. Like, it- okay. I do admit it is fun to debate and argue with people, but for dumb shit like this, I'm just like, bruh, come on. Like, I'd rather argue about issues or political things, because I feel like that has more meaning. No, no, let's- <laughs> no, let's not start this. Tomatoes are fruit. Yeah, you got gifted earlier. I think it was, um, Butler. Shout out to Butler. But you got lucky. It's always in a salad but not a fruit salad. Yeah, it's, if it's not in the Wiggles fruit salad song, it is technically not a fruit, guys. You heard it here. Is a hot dog a sandwich? No, it's not. It's another one of those fucking debates. I hate them. I hate them. I hate them. I mean, I'm not going to participate, but you guys can debate in the chat room. Like, have fun with yourselves. <laughs> It's like, get mad at each other, but don't get mad at me. <laughs> this chat is basically a fruit salad with a row of few tomatoes. <laughs> no, I thought you were making like a fruity joke. How? Yeah, it's prime. Pri okay, that's what you're trying to make. <laughs> okay, can I feel like, because I, I can see all my analogs for the channel. And it says, 99% of my new viewers find my channel through the LGBTQ tag. Which is crazy to me. Because, like, it's not that I brand myself as a queer creator. Like, I think it's it's part of my identity, but I don't, like, blast it. You know? Like, it's not my main focus of my identity. But I just find it interesting that you guys are finding me because I'm gay. Guys, I'm, I'm bi, I'm not gay. I like the boys too. 
<laughs> you just have a gay magnet. So why don't I have a girlfriend? Like, come on. Come on, dude. Does pineapple belong in pizza? Yes, it does. Yes, it does. If you don't think so, then you just have a bad palate. Oh, my least favorite conversation topic ever? Oops. Let's not talk about that. <laughs> L. Megan, bruh. Okay, also, I'm not trying. I'm not trying to get a girlfriend right now. But I tell you, if I tried... Too in Ezra and Ray. <laughs> it, it, it's like one of those subtle signals. Like the cuff jeans. And the piercings. No, I'm okay. If we're gonna talk about pizza real quick, I'm a total psycho when it comes to pizza. Like, if I look at my past, like, mob pizza order, I get ham, bacon, pineapple, spinach, olives. And the topper? I get sardines. I'm crazy like that. That sounds busting though. Did you hear the sardines part though? Some people either love sardines or hate them. There's no in between. I never tried them for the longest time because my mom hates fish. But honestly, anytime there's sardines on the menu, I will order it. Ooh, you know what I wish? I wish more American pizza places had shrimp. Because only one pizza place in my town offers shrimp. And their pizzas are like $30. It's totally not worth it. Oh, corn on pizza? That's a that's an Asian thing. Like, I know in Japan, they have corn. They put corn in everything. I hate them? <laughs> what? <laughs> pineapple and pizza. So, Lorenzo, are you saying you hate people who like pineapple on pizza? Because that's kind of rude. That's a, that's a big part of the population. <laughs> <clears throat> okay. Let's see what else needs to be done. Let us say. Yeah, mushrooms or pizza are pretty solid. They've never done me wrong. Okay, so we can do. Oh, there's the fruit already today too, huh? Hmm. Okay, it's good that we did Animal Crossing today because I have a lot to do in my island. <laughs> Plain cheese gang. Okay. Can I just say, Giorgio was in the food tier list stream. And Giorgio, weren't, weren't you the one who was saying Burger King is good? And now you're saying you like plain cheese? That is literally baby palette. That is little bitty baby palette you have right there. Why do people in America like ranch dressing? I used to not be a big fan of ranch. Because my mom would always get, um, like, blue cheese dressing. But I think people like the ranch because it's like a little bit twangy, a little bit funky. It adds a bit more like subtle acidity to it. <laughs> Not the call up. No, I had to say it. You, I know you voted against me at the end. It was kind of rude. Kind of cringe that you d betrayed me. Or I guess your new best friend at Cutie Lee. <laughs> Burger King is good. Okay, Decon, have you ever had American? American fast food is like the lowest quality of fast food you can get. Anytime I go to a foreign place out of the States and try their fast food, it is like 10 times better. <laughs> yeah, any other fellow Burger King haters in the chat room? I considered unfollowing. Bet. But then you lose your follow age, and if you refollow, you can't chat for 10 minutes. Get fucked. <laughs> No, McDonald's nuggets are bad. They are bad. Wait, what country did you say you're from, Nezrin? You said you're- I know you're from the EU. But I feel like- Because I when I went to Japan, their chicken nuggets were pretty good. 
Like, they actually tasted like chicken. Like, American McDonald's chicken nuggets are dog shit. They taste like fucking plastic. Ooh, bug. New bug. Hold. Easy. <laughs> Finland? Okay. I knew it was in that belt of the EU. <clears throat> See, the only thing I would try from Burger King are the chicken fries and the Impossible Burger. Everything else does not like appetizing. I'ma be honest. One day I will try Burger King, one day I will do it. But today is not the day. <laughs> I mean, it, to me it sounds like chicken fries is just like a chicken patty but in the form of a fry. Yeah, I remember that too, Lord. But it's just like people just don't realize that's how mass produced that's how mass food production works. <laughs> you know what's cringe that I did on Sunday during the collab stream? Um, <laughs> I told the chat room if I got- f It was on Katie's channel, Maddie, ch Katie Lear, on her channel. I said to the chat room, if I get five gifted subs in my offline chat, I'll order Burger King. <laughs> Obviously nobody did it, but it was such a stupid bit. <laughs> Cause I'm trying to think. Yeah, my Burger King is not too far from here, but it's still like a 40 minute walk. Like, it's not worth. Oh, Taco Bell is pretty good. And if you're from Finland, it's probably gonna be even better than American Taco Bell. The only thing I don't like about Taco Bell is like the lettuce quality. Kind of icky. Like, I don't like shredded lettuce. But in, in a taco, you kind of have to. <laughs> no, I did not argue about it. It was, it was, a, it was a bit. It was a shtick. Wendy's is the best fast food place for nuggets. Oh, uh, if we're talking about like a place that is not designated for chicken, I kind of have to agree. Oh, it's wobbling. It's shaking. Yo, tacos better? No. We are not starting that meta again, Mikey. Mikey tried to rig the election. He tried to steal the election. <laughs> Because, like, okay, chatters, whenever I do polls here, I'm not going to use bits because I'm not going to ruin your democratic right. I think that is unfair. Um, <laughs> but for chatters, if you don't know what we're talking about, um, I did a collab stream with my friend, Cutie Lee, and we ranked fast food. That is what we're talking about. I forgot to mention and preface with that. Um, but there was one poll, because how it worked is me and Katie each ranked the restaurants together. Wait, I chopped down the tree, didn't I? Oopsie. Um, Katie and I each ranked the food together, and then we had a separate tier list for the chat room. So for every single food option, chat could vote as well. And this little shithead Mikey, they spent 8 bits to add an additional 8 votes for Del Taco. No, it wasn't Del Taco, it was a different one. Um, no, it was White Castle, I think you did it on, right? So basically, a restaurant was pushed to the top because Mikey stuffed an additional 8 bits into the ballot box. And rig the election. Oh, we, we do have shredded lettuce here in the States. It's just bad. It's just bad. Gotta go. No problem. We'll see you next time, Tanuki. I hope you have a good day, man. Appreciated you chilling with us today. Does anybody like the Taco Bell taco? I usually get the crunch wrap, but with no tomatoes. That's my go-to order. Ooh, Taco Bell breakfast? God tier. There is nothing better than Taco Bell breakfast. It's because they have like the potato hash brown items and it's so good. There was a time where I ordered Taco Bell breakfast like once a week. It was not a good time of my life. Yeah, I agree. The Doritos Locos Tacos are better than the normal, but still like if okay. I said this before, but anytime I go to fast food, I'm not gonna get the cheapy value menu item. I'm always gonna get like the promotional or like the higher price item because usually they taste better like honestly <laughs> no 
I jumped it down. I got distracted. McDonald's breakfast is pretty solid, but their biscuits are always really dry, and their pancake McGriddles, it's too messy. I do like their breakfast plate, where you just get, like, the, the meats and then the eggs. Like, that's pretty solid, but their sandwich is kind of eh. <coughs> they had a Hot Pocket thing at Taco Bell? Dude, if there were any fast food place that sold something equivalent to, like, a Hot Pocket... I would be eating that shit every day. Cause like, I'm a big fan of calzones. Calzones is my favorite form of pizza. And like, the only place that offers calzones in my area is a pizza hut. And they're kind of dog shit. Because they get the same cook time as a pizza, so like, the calzones usually come out fucking burnt. Chatters, I, I used to work at a pizza place that might have had hut in the name, so I kind of know the inside shit. But... Yeah, literally! Chatters, okay. Anytime you go to, like, a, a fast food place or, like, a dine-in restaurant, don't be ashamed to use coupons or gift cards. Like, bruh, just use it. Just use it. There's no shame in it. Like, if you're gonna save five bucks, go for it. And sometimes, if you ask the worker at the register, but like, hey, you got any coupons or you got any promos? Usually they'll just give it to you. Sometimes you don't even need a physical coupon. But usually those workers aren't- they're not supposed to do that. So... Yeah, that's how, um, the, um, calzones work at pizza, too. It's just the personal pizza folded enough. Subway is pretty solid, but I used to work at a Subway, too. I'm never eating there unless I can make my own sandwich. Because food safety is... Okay, um... This is a problem. <laughs> Fired era. <laughs> Uh-oh. Mikey's in trouble. ruh -roh. Yeah, literally, Lorenzo. $20? I think the most expensive sub in my area is like... $13. Like, the only time I think a sub has been 20 bucks is if you get add-ons. Because I think to get the melt sandwiches is like an extra $1 or $2, right? <clears throat> um, I never worked in food service, so I want to ask. Is it a care move to ask for a new drink if it's too watered down? Um, what I would say, if it's fast food, you can just be like, hey... No, what you do, you just get a different soda pop. Get a different soda pop, because they don't give a shit. Just be like, hey, I noticed that your Coca-Cola is out. That way they have a reminder to change the bib. And then wait five minutes and then fill your soda pop. And hopefully they change the bib. And yeah, I think that's the best you can do, because I feel like with a lot of service jobs, even though if they're trained to be good customer service workers, a lot of people don't care, and it's unfortunate that people don't take those type of jobs seriously. And ultimately, when we talked about this before, but um, your work, your weakest worker represents your whole team because you're only as strong as your weakest worker. So it sucks that people don't care about their jobs, even if it's like minimum wage or entry level. Like people still need to put the same amount of care as you would put into like an actual career job. Um, I would say, if you're, like, going into any, like, food service place or fast food, like, be as nice as you can, even if they're kind of rude. Because if they're starting off in a bad mood, and you be kind of mean or rude to them back, it's only going to upset them. And you don't want a confrontation. It's not going to make you feel better. It's not going to make them feel better. So, TLDR. Try and be as nice as possible. Um... That's all I can really say. Because, like, working any job is stressful, but working a job where you always feel disrespected from customers, from your higher-ups, your managers, your fellow co-workers, it's stressful. It's not fun. So, that's my spiel. <laughs> I literally bust. <laughs> uh, TMI. <laughs> but yeah, Subway cookies are pretty good. Ooh, Chatters, if you go to Subway... Um, I don't know what to do. My inventory is fucking full, so... Um... 
I think we gotta end it here, guys. I have to rearrange my storage. And I don't want to do that on a stream because that's boring. This looks like one of those blow up, like, tree things. <laughs> Nezrin, I thought you were gonna say, like, something actually bad happened, but they just took the milkshakes off the menu. No! <laughs> Oh, wait, I was gonna say something about cookies. Okay, so I'm gonna end Animal Crossing here, guys. Uh, wait, I can sell some fruit. I'll sell some fruit. Um, but what you do, chatters, if the employee looks like they're in a good mood, only if they're in a good mood, okay? You politely ask the worker, hey, can you put my cookie in the toaster for 10 seconds? And it makes your cookie, even if it's rock hard, because I know sometimes cookie, like the cookies at Subway are dog shit because they're, um, Subway cookies, insider information, the shelf life is only good for a day, so ideally, they should be thrown out or donated at the end of the day every day. But you know they don't do that. So, what you do, even if your cookie is rock hard, you ask them to toast it for 10 seconds, it's gonna be soft and gooey and delicious. So, life hacks. My mom would've let you have Subway, really? Huh? I mean, Subway is definitely overpriced. Like, I can see, like, my mom... I was only allowed to get Subway when I was little if I got, like, a lot of A's in my report card. Like, if I did solid on my report card, I got, like, five A's. This is elementary, mind you. Um, my mom would, like, take me to Subway and I'd get a meatball sub. That was my treat. <laughs> well, hi, welcome to Stream Titan. Hope you're doing well today. Okay, well... I'm bummed that my inventory is full. The reason why it is full is because I am prepping for next, not this Sunday, but next, next Sunday's Animal Crossing cooking stream. So my inventory is loaded. It is full. Um, yeah. So, chatters, let's go ahead and save here. Oh, wait, CJ is here. We need, wait, hold. We need to find CJ. We can do that real quick, actually. I forgot. We can do some fishing. You hate the meatball subs? Really? Really? I think the meatball subs are fun. Okay. Wait. I know I talked about the sandwiches you should not order from Subway. And I know I told you guys not to order the tuna and the chicken patty. Because those are usually served past their shelf light date. So that means they are expired even though they are still being served. Um, another thing is probably don't order the meatball either, because, um, you know how the meatballs are kept in the hot well? A lot of the time, because the shelf life for meatballs is four hours, but I know, I can promise you it's on the hot well for more than four hours. Um, so that me that's why usually, like, the meatballs are really soggy and kind of achy. It's because they're being kept warm for too long. So chatters. Oh, here's CJ. We found him. Um, don't get the meatball either. Add that to the list of sandwiches to not order. This is not slander, Subway. I'm just telling you the truth. <clears throat> okay, let's get our CJ voice on. Okay. I'm channeling my inner douchebag. Anyway. Ever since I started doing my sea sports challenges, I've been trending in a huge way. It's so slick. Each time somebody navigates a challenge, I offer to buy up their fish. I even pay premium. I only offer to buy after a challenge, though. Keeps it interesting. <laughs> but everyone's aboard. Wait, but everyone's aboard. I get way fresh fish for my live stream, and the lucky angler gets showered in bells. So, how about a challenge sea sports style right now? When did I make it? Our Win and I'll make a ring and I'll talk you up on my stream. Oh my god, he's gonna shout us out, guys. We're gonna get a plug from CJ. Imagine how many followers I'm gonna get today from CJ's stream. <clears throat> Plus, my partner's into making slick collectibles if you want one. He's so talented. <laughs> okay, let's do the challenge. Meg wins out. Yeah, story time. The reason why I applied to Subway initially is because I saw his video and I worked with the company for three years. Kind of crazy. Oh, five fish? Easy clap. I can do that. First try. First try. First try. Any fish up here? He can catch one right in front of him. No, but he'll catch it on camera for his live stream. Only if I win? What? Only if I win what? Your mom's heart? Ooh, got him. 
Oh, fish. They're not expired, they're aged. Ugh. See, that's the type of shit I would hear from, like, managers and franchisees. But it's like... I talked about this on Sunday. Like, there's a reason why the shelf life is limited. Like, I don't understand. Like, yes, throwing away food sucks, but if you're gonna get people sick, it's not worth it. Not cool. The second time you got me with your mom joke? Yeah, easy clap. I don't do it often, but I try and shoot for at least one year mom joke a stream. So that is my one for today, guys. <laughs> Well, at least you came back, Raven. I didn't... I didn't destroy you too hard. <laughs> well, that's two, baby! Run a streak. Oh, one more. See, I think your mom jokes are good, but it's like one of those jokes where you know the setup, you know the punchline. So you have to use them sparingly. You can't be using them all the time. That's why, like, I slip them in sometimes. <laughs> I was playing with my friend. Well, I was playing with my sister and then her friend. Because, like, we'll all play, like, Switch games for, like, hours sometimes. And I was talking to him. And he's like, yeah, you're actually funny. And I was like, imagine. Because we were talking about streaming, because he was like, he doesn't know anything about Twitch, so he was like, interested and curious, so I told him like, my experience and like, what the platform is. And he's like, so, people just... Okay, granted, he's young. He's two years younger than me, so he's not a fucking boomer. So he's like, so you just do games, right? I'm like, yeah, I do games. And he's like, well, what makes people watch? I'm like, well, I'm not necessarily good at games, so like, I guess I'm entertaining. And I was like, I'm kind of funny. And he's like, I guess. And that was near the beginning of our call. And then near the end, he's like, yeah, you're actually funny. Because <laughs> we were playing Fall Guys and I was making jokes. And like, I wasn't making stupid... No! No, guys, I threw, just like the Mario Kart, I threw on the last fish. Just like the last race earlier. Oh my god. God, fuck. Yeah, I feel like the people who are homophobic have internalized homophobia. And it's one of those things that they have to battle and figure out on their own. But if you're gonna choose to be outwardly hateful, that's not good. That's not... They need to learn how to fix that behavior. It's unfortunate that it happens, but... It's kind of like the cliche of going back to your high school after you've graduated. And like talking to your bully. And they're like, oh, you know, I reflected, I've thought about it, and I, I feel sad. I don't like gay people, but you are funny and decent. Uh, see that? That type of shit. Because those people, those individuals, it, it sucks because they will immediately dehumanize you and ostracize you for, like, one aspect of your whole personality. I hope that person changes their opinion and their POV. Like, it- Ugh. Like, I don't understand how people can be, like, so, like, outwardly and, like, proudly hateful. Like, it's- it's insane to me. Like, just because you don't understand a group of people or somebody doesn't mean they're a lesser person. Yeah. Like I said, they probably have a lot of, like, internalized shit. Anyway, Pride Month is over, guys. <laughs> no, I'm trolling, I'm trolling. See, like, I don't mind talking about heavier stuff sometimes. It's just, like, for certain conversations, um, sometimes I'm not equipped to, I guess, handle all conversations. 
Because I will only talk about things that I feel like I'm well educated in or I have personal experience in. So, I will always advocate for certain things. But, like, I know for me, I will always support, like, oh my god! Yeah, I need, I need to drop some shit off. I will always support, like, trans issues. I will always support trans rights. But I don't have any lived experience. So I can't necessarily fully relate to those individuals. Like, I will still advocate. I will still donate to organizations. I will still show my support. But I can't give my input sometimes because I don't, I don't know what it's like to live in their shoes. Fuck! I'm so good at fishing! Come on, I'll do it first try, first try. Oh my god. Yeah, America kind of sus. Kind of cringe. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> you know what else I'm good at? Running ad breaks because chatters, we are another hour into stream. So, chatters, it is time for me to run a few minutes of ads. You can avoid that ad break by subscribing for just $4.99, just $5. Skip your coffee today and get ad previewing all month long. Or if you have an Amazon Prime link in your Twitch, you got a free Prime sub every month. Why is my copy pasta gone? I don't know. Do you want it again? There's your copy pasta. There you go, Giorgio. <laughs> anyway, we're gonna finish off this fucking fishing challenge. And then, we're going to be... I have put my Tupperware across the room. I don't want to stand up. Then we'll be taste testing crumble cookies. So, chatter stick a round. Um, gentle reminder, get some water. Get some snacks if you need it. We'll see some of you guys in a few. <laughs> that coffee pasta is so good. I need to save- wait, do, is there a clipboard for a desktop? There isn't. Because I know for like, for my Samsung phone, there's a clipboard and you can like pin stuff to it. <clears throat> so I have that coffee pasta like pinned to my clipboard on my phone. That way I can type it in people's chats. <laughs> But, yeah, honestly, Nezra and Ia was looking better and better by the day. Fuck, oh my god. Um, is ketchup a smoothie? No. Because, okay, I feel like for smoothies, it has to be a medley of fruits. Fuck me. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Am I just bad at the game? Ooh, another shark. Okay, I cannot mess up here. I got it. It's a baby shark, though. Yeah, because like I said, I think the determining factor with the smoothie is it usually is a medley of fruits, so meaning different types of fruits, and also it usually has like base, so like either like yogurt or milk. I would say no. Okay, when you go to a restaurant, is ketchup smoothie an option? No, it is not. So therefore, no. I went to Applebee's a while ago. Ooh, I got a colagen. And I think, ooh, when I went, they had a strawberry coconut smoothie. The coconut flavor was good, but the strawberry syrup was way too strong. Okay, chatters, mind you, I don't go to Applebee's all the time. I literally don't leave the house. Like, I don't eat out ever. But I had a $25 gift card that I've had for ten, literally 10 years. And I finally used it. I went out and used my gift card. <laughs> Is applesauce a smoothie? I, I, I... Uh... I had a lisp there. Uh, okay. 
When I was little, I didn't have a stutter. I didn't have a lisp. It's something I've developed as I've gotten older, and it's so fucking annoying. Okay, I'm not gonna divulge in this topic, because it's, it's gonna cause me to, like, spiral. But I'm at the point where, like, I can notice it happening in my speech, my vernacular, and I'm just like... Why- why can't I fix it? Like, it's definitely gotten better since I've started, like, streaming. Um... Because streaming kind of forces me to talk more, so I, I get to practice speaking out loud more. But it's, it's- it's like frustrating! But thank god I didn't have a lisp when I was younger. Like, I would get bullied so hard. Can you explain how to pronounce... Kaliakinth? K- I think it's how you say it. Kaliakinth? I don't know. <laughs> okay, finally, my winning streak is over. Thank God. How many tries did it take? Like four? Yeah, Luigi, how about you actually try and put tomatoes, tomatoes in a smoothie and see how it works out? You can- you can answer your question on your own. <laughs> we can debate all we want, but you know... You gotta try it out, I guess. Oh yeah, CJ was here. I forgot where he was. I lost her. Drink V8? Oh my god, I loved V8. Cause what I liked about V8 is that they weren't thick, it was like juice more so. <clears throat> okay, some folks see this weather and I and say can't fish is raining, but I look at it and say fish don't know I'm wet. No way, you already caught five fish in a row. No shot. No, that's gonna make the chat explode. So much for my sea sports challenge. Wait, fish. <laughs> Photo app. Wait, I have the perfect emote for this. Hold. Where is it? Right here. Right here. This is a Maya emote and I love it so much. I got gifted a sub and I'm considering resubscribing to her just so I can keep this Maya 4K emote. It's so good. <clears throat> Way to wreck that Sea Sports challenge! What a haul! Do you want to sell any of those fish? Because I want to buy. Sure, why not? Let me get the blender. <laughs> okay, do it. Bet. <laughs> Dude, we have a blender in our kitchen, but we haven't touched it in, like, months. Okay, I think... I don't know if I have enough of those, so let's go ahead and sell the rest. Oh, wait, he's talking about the tourney! I skipped through it, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> Oopsie. Well, he basically said the tournament is coming up, which we are doing that extra stream on Saturday. So chatters look forward to that. But I think that is all we will do for Animal Crossing today. So let's go ahead and save. Actually, finally save now. I stalled for long enough. <clears throat> but chat, what we are going to do now is chat has been waiting all day for this. But we are going to finally taste test. For me, the first time trying crumble cookies. So I'm going to go ahead and get some music set up for you guys. See, you're making fun of Giorgio, but honestly, I like veggies much either. So I guess I'm a little nine-year-old too. No, that's weird. That's weird. <laughs> I, have a, I have a little baby palette too. Why is my music not late? Oh, there it is. Okay. Is the music good? Is it at a good level? I did audio test earlier. It should be at a good level. But. Okay, so check that. Let me go grab the cookies. And change my title. Oh, my camera shut off. It's back. Save. It's good, thank you, Mac. Because I did a test stream earlier on my alt. Okay. 
So I'm, I'm gonna title this I Try Crumble <laughs> Wait, I see I switched scenes. Oopsie. It's because I had the hashtag. Okay, hold, chatters, hold. Page in my category, moderators. Okay. Why did you switch the scene? Okay. We'll chat. Okay. Let me go grab the cookies. <clears throat> Wait, I have to actually pull it up. So, chat, chat. If you aren't already, I usually update stuff on my Twitter. But yesterday, I decided to treat myself and purchase a big old box of cookies. You know, it was holiday. We didn't have anybody over, but you know. I was like, I'm gonna treat myself, I'm gonna spend way too much money on cookies. Dude, it cost like 56 bucks because I got them delivered, so that was 10 bucks. And then I got the 12 pack. They're like $4 each, which is... It's fine, it's fine. But I got a big old box of cookies. So this one is, I think, rainbow confetti or... Because it's holiday, it's got like 4th of July sprinkles. Um, apple pie. Chocolate chip regular, s'mores, and then icy flavor, I think. So those are the flavors I got. So I prepped little sample pieces for me, for myself. Wait, I X'd out the music, didn't I? Hold one second. I dropped the ball there. But look at this. Look at this. The shine. Big box says 12. That's the biggest box I could get. Unless I want to get, like, a whole ass catering order. That'd be insane. But, guys, the cookies are, like, this big. They are, like, four inches. They are huge. Okay, so, what I did, because the cookies are big, is I, I pre-cut them into quarters. My share got put in Tupperware because I know my sister would eat my share. So, this was the icy s'mores, apple pie... And then, I guess, America flavor. I put them in a glass Tupperware because I was debating. Because when I bought them, they got delivered to my house in like an hour. So fairly quickly, surprisingly. So I was debating. Should I microwave these for like 10 seconds? That way they're like kind of warm. That way they get that fresh out of the oven feel. Should I microwave these? I don't know. Because then the frosting would melt, right? Thoughts? Maybe? I don't know. I'm conflicted. I don't know. I don't know. Well, let's go ahead and try. The one- okay, so when I cut them, I did lick the knife that had frosting on it. So I tried a little bit of the icy frosting. But, I'm gonna try the apple pie first. <laughs> what did the icy melt? Yeah, that's what I was thinking. So I don't think I'm gonna look them. But this is the apple pie. Oh, look at that focus, dude. So this one, if you look at the cross section. It's shaped like a pie, because the the edge has like a crust texture on it. And then I assume it's just like pie filling. Let's try it. Okay, the cookie is a little bit dry. Let's try a little bit of the filling. It just tastes like pie filling. It's really cinnamony, so pretty solid, but the cross section, there's not a lot of filling on it. Like, I want more filling. I think because, like, I expected it to be, like, a mini pie they get from, like, the grocery store. Yeah, I agree, Decon. Like, there's not enough, there's not enough pie in it. There's not enough filling. I think it's because, um, <clears throat> what was I gonna say? Because, like, you know the actual pie, the crust is, like, non-existent. And then it's all filling. Like, I don't like the ratio as much, but it's still good. The ice, the, um, the filling part is good. <laughs> mukbang stream one. I've thought about doing, like, a mukbang stream as a gag. But I genuinely feel like people would call me fat. And I don't like that. 
it does look dry. It, it is. I think it's slightly underdone, too. Right, what I do know about crumble cookies is that they intentionally underbake them. That way they're still gooey, and I kind of like that texture. But for that one, it wasn't good. It, it kind of tasted like... I was going to say sherbet, but it's not sherbet. My stream keeps lagging, really? Try refresh your tab. Because it says it's mine. It's good on my end. Oh, yeah. It's, it's probably you then, Raven. <laughs> Hi, welcome back to Stream Lemon. Um, what did you miss? Everything. <laughs> okay, which one should I try next? We got birthday cake, icy, and then s'mores. You're capping, Luigi. You're capping. The blue one? Okay, let's try the blue one. So this one was icy flavored. Like, you know, the ices you get from the gas station. So it has this one little peppermint looking piece. And then it also has like clear, like the clear crystal sprinkles. I'm going to try the little peppermint piece. Oh. It's like a fruit... Licorice, almost. It's kind of good. It's like the little... I guess it's like a straw decoration. It's pretty good. <laughs> yeah, you want to post the recipe in the chat room, Luigi? <laughs> okay, so the icing on this cookie is hard. It's like... Like, you know, like actual cookie icing, it hardens. It's not like super hard like a gingerbread icing would be, but it's kind of soft. And like the cross section. I like the icing ratio much better on this one. And you can also kind of see here. See how it's kind of underbaked? Like slightly. Stop it, Deacon. <laughs> Stop. But. Yeah. So. I think all their, like, shooky cooking base are the same. Because it's the same cookie as the apple pie. But the icy frosting, super sweet. But I, I think I've had this frosting before. Like, like you know when you go to the grocery store and they have, like, those Play-Doh-looking-ass cheapy cookies with the bright frosting and the sprinkles on it? I think I got a- it's blue raspberry flavor, I forgot to mention. It is so sweet, but I feel like little kids would love it. Little kids would love this. Rate them all out of 10. I'm going to do that at the end. Because I feel like I need to gauge which is the worst and which is better. <laughs> and like, the frosting, it immediately, like, sticks to the roof of my mouth. So texture-wise, it's not as good. But it's super sweet. Your little five-year-old cousin would love it. <clears throat> okay. So, we got the... I'm not gonna eat all of it because it's a bit too sweet. Not as good as the apple, but still solid. I think I'm gonna do the s'mores one next. Because, chatters, I'm gonna be honest. I'm not a big fan of chocolate cookies. I'm not a fan. I feel like it's it tastes fake. Like, the chocolate tastes fake. Because it's cocoa powder, not actual chocolate. So this one... Yeah, when I cut it, it had a big-ass marshmallow in the center. And then it appears to be like a graham cracker base and then chocolate. So it's cute. Because like, all the videos I see of them promoting the cookies, they're super aesthetic and the shots are sick. That one looks busted. <laughs> we'll see, we'll see. I'm gonna try the marshmallow a bit. I feel like you need to go for that first. Okay, like I said, I am not a fan of chocolate cookies. Like, you know the double chocolate kind? I love chocolate chip, but I am not a fan of double chocolate like base cookies. And this one, since I've been into the center, it was underdone, which I understand is how it's supposed to be. But it tasted like, you know when you're making brownies and you lick the batter bowl? It... It tasted like that. Like, it tasted like I, I ate 
like a hunk of batter and it was not good delectable no yeah i didn't like it it see like i like when like chocolate chip cookies are that gooey but for double chocolate cookies i don't i don't like it i think my sister would like this one but not not me i'm gonna try a bit i'll take another bite but like the graham cracker part Yeah, it's mid. Okay, okay. The part, because like, as you can see, it's like the graham cracker and then double chocolate swirl. The graham cracker part definitely like tones down the chocolate a lot better. I feel like it needs to be more graham cracker base than chocolate base. So that one, eh, it's eh. I wouldn't I wouldn't order again okay finally my voice crack we have the America flavor so this one oh, the icing isn't set it looks like cupcake icing that like it stays soft as you can see it's intentionally underbaked and it's got like it's so hard to hold all this I should have broken out the second camp shouldn't I and then it's got like America confetti sprinkles. Deluxe too. This one, this one, if you look at how much icing is on here, this to me is perfect. Like, this is how much icing you put on a cupcake. This, because I personally love icing. Okay, I'm a total psychopath when I eat a cupcake. Like, I usually will eat the bottom and then leave the top. That way it's just like a top with icing on it. That's how I eat my fro- That's how I eat my cupcakes. I know it's psychotic. But I'm a big fan of icing. I just lick off the top. Yep. <laughs> what state will I be eating first? Um, Idaho, because they got potatoes. And the people from Idaho are crazy. This one is good. This one is good. It tastes like... You know the... Look, Betty Crocker icing they have in the little tub? It tastes like that, but better. It's not buttercream, but it's got that kind of like slight sour taste you get from buttercream. It's good. I feel like the cookie is too big though. Like this one is a lot thicker than the other ones, but it's good. I'm in Idaho. Well, goodbye, Lemon. <laughs> Similar problem. I feel like these would have tasted a lot better yesterday when I bought them. That might be the problem. Like, all these cookies are kind of dry, but still pretty solid. I think this one's good. It's literally breaking apart in my hands. Another thing I would like to point out- fuck, it- it fell, it fell. Um. When I bought them, I touched all the cookies. To like, see how soft they were, because that's a really good indicator. Because if your cookie is rock hard, then you know it's at least a day old. Like, it's at least a day old, right? So. I touched all the cookies, because I had- I had to cut them too, so obviously I could touch them all. But all of the chocolate chip cookies I got, because I think I got four of the 12 pack, all the chocolate all the chocolate chip cookies were hard. So that means either they were baked earlier in the morning or baked the previous day, which is fine. Because cookies are usually good for a while, as long as they're like vacuum sealed. But I didn't Do I'm gonna go grab a chocolate chip one? I thought I'll go grab one. Because I've tasted the chocolate chip before. I need Hawaii, Ohio, because who wouldn't? Come on. What have we got to lose, True? I'll go grab it. Chatter, stick here. Please don't leave for the love
I am back. Chat, I have returned. I think Florida have a weird aftertaste? Probably. Florida's crazy, man. Okay, so here's the chocolate chip. As I said, this one is hard. Like, it's a firm cookie. But as you can see, the cross section. This one is another one that was not fully cooked. Because you can see how, like, the dough isn't as dark here in the center. Dude, look at my nails. Oh my god. <laughs> So I, I've tried the chocolate chip before. Like, it's always pretty salt. Oh, you know what I love? See how big the actual chips are? They are huge. They are massive. It is good. <laughs> A thing, like an analogy I came up with this morning was the intentionally gooey texture of um, the cookies. It kind of, to me, tastes like what wet Play-Doh would feel like. So, I mean, it's fine if you don't see it that way. I clipped my table. But, it's good. <laughs> those, are, those are our cookies left. So if we're talking about how good they were, if we're talking about texture, I think the texture of the base chocolate chip is the best. And then overall, I guess, flavor, I think the best, like, cohesively, had to be mm, either the Funfetti one or the Apple Pie. It's, you, I just love, out, like, I like fruit flavors, so I think I gravitate towards that. But I think the icing on the Funfetti one was the best. Like, I'm gonna lick that off after stream. Um, I'm not a fan of the s'mores one. The marshmallow was good, but the chocolate base, not good. I didn't like it. I, I just don't like double chocolate cookies. And then the icy one. I think the icing was too sweet for me, but I feel like if you bought it for your little cousin, they would enjoy it. So all in all, pretty good. I would definitely buy from them again. It is a problem. That they have weekly menu changes. That is going to be an issue. But yeah, it was good. Thank you, chat, for bullying me to finally buy cookies. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to go rinse my hands real quick. Oh, was I supposed to rank them, like, top ten? Um... Let's bring them by like my favorite. Sanitizing so my hands aren't sticky. <clears throat> we can build me up to Burger King next. Okay, chatters. Chatters. If somebody gives me five subs at any point in time in one go. I will order Burger King on stream and I'll taste test it. Handshakes? Okay, if you think about it, five subs will cover the cost of the food. So basically, if a chatter buys me, gives me money enough to buy Burger King, then I'll try it on stream. Handshakes? Next paycheck, let's go. Handshakes? I think that's fair. Handshakes. Yeah, I did see a recipe, Luigi. I was taking a mental note. I took a screenshot, actually. I was like, I'm gonna... <laughs> I think it's a range up. <laughs> okay, okay. Was that fun, chatters? Now you guys can stop teasing me to try fucking grumble, because I did it on stream. And I can't... You guys can't tease me anymore. Wait, wait, wait. Can I do the... The piece I 2 tisk now? Wait, wait. I feel like it, the crop has to be bigger. I really think that was good, that was good. <laughs> okay, so chat, chat, we're going to move on. I know stream is going a bit longer than usual, but it is time to thank our subs. So chat is what we're doing now. Anybody who cheers, subs, gifts, or donates at the end of stream gets their name written in our sub-only journal. 
And if you can't afford to sub, no problem. You can use your channel points and I will write your name for free. Ta-da! Do I ever stream Pokemon? Not at this point. Maybe in the future? Oh, put my finger closer, like this? I feel like that'd be too big, though. I don't know. I'll, I'll workshop it off stream, too. Okay. Let me grab the journal. Oh, I think we're gonna fill another page today. Let's go. Um, people can read it in the chat room, Luigi. I'm not gonna read stuff out loud just because somebody tells me to. I don't like giving my chatters too much control over me, so don't feel bad about it. It's just how I run stream. Lord of Dead, we'll do your name right now! Since you redeemed it. Since you're still here. <laughs> and we just gotta scroll up in the chat room. Should be there. Okay, so. <sighs> Luigi Green, okay, no problem. But thank you guys for redeeming. I know I say this every time, but calligraphy is like one of my favorite parts of stream. Because it's so soothing. Okay, we got Lord of D.E.D. <laughs> Lord of Dead. Okay, so this would probably be the closest to Luigi Green, yeah? This one is a little bit darker. Yeah, I think this one is actually closer to it. Okay, we'll do your name next, Lemon. Thank you for redeeming. Yeah, for sure, Lord. No problem. It's like a little extra thing you do. And I think it's super satisfying to, like, see your name being written out. I know I think I think chatters also like this part of stream too <laughs> and it's a nice way to like chill and end stream oh I didn't change my title no, nobody told me moderators uh, what is it? I'm changing my title hold chatters There we go. Thank you, Luigi. I'm working on it. Almost done. But chatter, just a reminder. For any chatter or viewer who gifts a total of five subs for the month of July will get a custom sketch card for them drawn on stream. Here's an example. So just a gentle reminder for anybody who gives five subs to the channel in the month of July will get a custom portrait card drawn of them. What if I redeem it five times? Well, you can't. Try and look at it. I have a limited at one per stream, so nice try, chatter. You thought you could fool me, but I have a trump card. Okay, we got Luigi Gamer 64. Don't ever say that again. It's my anime protagonist voice. It's funny. It's funny. Haha. -ha. 
such a nice try chatter. I think it's funny. And the lemon said they wanted blue. Ooh, let's do the baby blue. I like this one a lot. Here we go, iced lemon vanilla. <laughs> Five subs is expensive? Hmm. Well, if you think about it, let's see their brains. A normal art commission is about $25, right? Because each sketch card takes 20 to 30 minutes. So I think it's fair. Because keep in mind, chatters, I only get a portion of that 25. So. Yeah, I agree, Dika. I agree. Because, like, I thought about it. And. I think five is decent. Like I said, it's extra. It's something extra. Because in previous months, if people gifted, they got nothing. Well, I mean, they, they got calligraphy. But. It's just something extra. And if people like it, then I'll keep doing it. If people don't like it, then I'll stop. So. And chatters, don't ever feel obligated to donate to the stream. Like, seriously, if you can't afford it, then don't do it. Like, I totally get it. So don't ever feel bad or feel like you're missing out. Because anything that I do extra for people who do donate, like in terms of calligraphy or drawing, I'll always do it on stream. That way you guys can at least see it. How much is five subs? Um, it's about $25. About $5 per sub, so nothing too crazy. But I can understand why some people can't afford to get it, and that's not a problem. It's just something extra. Because I don't want to, like, officially take commissions, because I feel like commissions are, like, super overwhelming. <clears throat> okay, so first, we're moving on to our sub journal now. So these are people who either cheered, donated, or gifted during the stream earlier today. I need to find where my guidelines are. Like, I do like this harsher light, but it is a lot harder to like look at my guidelines so if chatters if you look at your chat box where is it it'd be here <laughs> no it'd be no wrong way it'd be here if you look at your chat box there's a leaderboard right so anybody who gets five for the month if you're on the leaderboard and have at least five for the month of july then you'll have that portrait card made So this emerald green is really pretty. Yeah, I mean, you just gotta work how many more hours at your <laughs> child labor job? <laughs> I'm kidding, chatters. Don't ever feel obligated to donate to the stream. It's always something extra if you want to do to help support. Because honestly, I think being in the stream and you having a good time is 10 more times important than getting subs or donos. Because yes, money is nice, but if I didn't have chatters or viewers, where would I be? You're on mobile, so I pointed wrong? No! I fucked up! Three hours easy. Yeah, just three hours. <laughs> okay, so we had Jay Butler at the beginning of the stream with five tier one subs. They are going to get their portrait card at the end of the month.
Because, like, I was debating, because I asked my friends if I should do the portrait cards or not, and they said it was a good idea. Because I have the kind of mindset to where, when I'm still small, and if I ever do get big, I think it's important to acknowledge the people who were there from the start, or who helped you along with your streaming journey near the beginning. So that's why I'm doing all these extra things for people who donate, so. It's not- okay. I am doing it to farm a little bit, mind you, like a little bit. But it's not the main reason why I do it. If you ever, when you do, maybe one day. Pokium one day I'll be famous. But see, like... I don't necessarily want that to happen, though, TBH. Like, I like being small. Because, like, if I ever do pop off and get big, we'll lose... The vibe, I guess. <laughs> oh yeah, I forgot about tax. <laughs> dude, I hate tax. <laughs> yeah, tax fucks you over, dude. Okay, and then we had... In that sense, I hope you stay little. But also... <laughs> yeah, that's definitely like the biggest appeal to people who are small, is you get to have that one-on-one -on -one interaction. Okay, so we had Not Mac with a total of three gifted subs all in the up today. Oh my god. You're crazy. <laughs> you want me to be rich? Okay. I'm conflicted about ever pursuing streaming seriously. Because a lot of streamers' revenue is through donations, like crowdfunding, subs, and that type of thing. So it's somewhat toxic to an extent. So I would only pursue streaming seriously in terms of like sustainable income if I had a good handful of paying viewers or like an, a platform on a different social media site that had a significant following that I could monetize. Like, you know, people get like Instagram or TikTok sponsorships, that type of thing. But there is no way you can make substantial income from Twitch unless you are big. That is the problem. So it's a line that I'm trying to like tread lightly and it's, I'm like kind of conflicted about. Because like I know I do show subs, I know I do can gaff, but having people, like your sole source of income being depending on the donations of other people is not good for long term and it's also exploitative to an extent. Like I said, that is a big reason why I like to take the time to acknowledge the people who do donate. You pay for what you watch, true. I think that's also nice how like Twitch is a free platform still, like it's not paywall. Like the only paywall type of content you can do on Twitch is if you do a subscriber only stream, which I do not have access to just yet, but I might in the future. So I might do subscriber only streams. But I'm still, because like I know I said before at the Mario Kart tournament that Future tournaments will be subscriber only, but then I thought about it. Is this pen really dying too? Oh my god, I'm gonna fucking scream. I just got these pens, like. I'm hitting it against my finger. I don't think that's gonna help, but. Okay, it didn't help. End me. No, I don't I don't have a color that's close enough. Dude. Uh... Oh my god, dude. I'm excuse I'm sorry. <laughs> no, I'm not licking the pen. I okay, chatters. If I lick something on stream, that's not an earphone mic. I get clapped. I get banned. Okay, I'm not licking it. <laughs> I'm not doing it. Okay, this is the same color, but it's not glittery. So sad. Feels bad, man. I mean, y'all probably can't tell the difference. But I can tell. Yeah, Mac is on this page twice. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, so we had Mac with a total of three tier one subs to chat room today. You kind of can. Well, I don't want to get clapped, okay? Because what happens with a lot of small streamers? Is if you get banned? When you're small, you're likely to never be unbanned. You know why? It's because 
like the partnered streamers who have a massive audience and influence. Well, that's one page done. Let's go. This will be posted on Twitter later. Because why would they keep someone off the platform when they're making money for them? No, I mean, you can kind of see the color difference. Oh. Oopsie. Well, I misinterpreted Lamau. <laughs> okay, next we next we have Nyx. I don't know. <laughs> Five head moment. Well that, that's what I like about the Twitch chat room. Is that like you guys can talk to me live and ask me questions and we can talk about stuff, but it's so easy to misinterpret. And I think another big thing is too, you kinda lose that context. To where, like, you know how, like, on Twitter it was popular to add, like, tone indicators? And I think those were really helpful. But if people are saying something, I don't know if they're joking or being serious or not. That's why, like, if someone, um, that's a nice way of saying it. Like, if it's a joke that doesn't come off well, then I'll kind of, like, either delete it or pinpoint it and explain why it's not okay. It's kind of like how when we were in Animal Crossing, and I kind of explained the burning people joke for the baking thing like we have to take a step back and reflect because it's very easy to like misinterpret in the moment right <laughs> yeah basically if you don't reflect it's a problem you may lose your future that too well okay the whole concept of cancel culture, I think it's kind of redundant in a sense, because... Don't tell me this pen is broken! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I don't think people should not do things because they think they'll get canceled or get backlash. You should do things because it is a good thing to do. And you should do not do- and you, and you should not do bad things because it is wrong to do so. That is my opinion. So if your main reason why you're not doing something is because you will get backlash or hate for it, then you need to reflect on your actions. And think, maybe I need to reflect on my behaviors, maybe I need to reflect on my character. Because if all I care about is my reputation, then maybe you're not a good person. I don't, that's just my opinion. Like, you should do things because it's a good thing. You should be good because you are good. You should not do a good act just to get positive attention. That's why, like, I don't often speak about current activist movements publicly. I was not looking the pens. <laughs> um, because I will always keep my opinions private for the most part. Unless I feel like it's a substantial enough issue that pertains to me and my lived experience. Okay, so we have Nyx with a 3 month resub and then a 500 bit tier. That this is all just my opinion, like the way I kind of conduct myself. Because... If you change your behavior to only be good for positive attention, then what happens when you lose your social media presence? What happens when you lose your friends? Are you still going to be a good person? Think about that. Gotta go, no problem. We'll see you next time, Nezrin. I'm glad we got to hang out with you for today. I know it's not often you can be here because you know you're EU, but it's a pleasure. We'll see you next time, hon. Um, I don't know. I'm, I'm Okay, so we had next, and the next we had finally Decon. Dance a reminder, chatters, if you want to be in the journal, you can sub tier or donate, or you can use your channel points and I'll write it for free. Uh, what was I gonna say? Like, I have very, I guess, harsh opinions when it comes to morality. Because... What's the reason why? I think it's always important to be, like, self-critical and reflective in the sense of improving your behaviors. 
Because ultimately, you don't want to hurt anyone. And you should always do things like well intent. Yes, there will be times where you mess up. Yes, there will be times where you say the wrong thing. But as long as you are able to, I guess, support your opinion in the moment and emphasize that you had well intentions, I think that is fine. Okay, we'll see you next time, Luigi. It's a pleasure. Hope you have a great day, Han. I think that's a big reason why I'm very blunt and straightforward. Is one, because I don't want people to misinterpret me. Like, I know there are times where that will happen. Where I come off either too brazen or straightforward. But, like, I'm not the type of person to play games. You know, I don't play with feelings. I think that is wildly inappropriate. Because people need to keep in mind that whoever you interact with, whether it be someone you know briefly, someone you keep close to you, they are still a person at their core. No, Mac is still here. They were saying bye to other people. Because, <laughs> you know, they're a good chatter. No, I, I get what you're saying, Deacon. Like, it takes a lot of courage to, I guess, speak up and voice your opinions on things because like I said it, it's very easy to like face backlash for certain opinions whether they may be progressive or potentially right there there are people who don't like both opinions right um so only feel comfortable to speak up if you only speak up if you feel comfortable to do so like it takes a lot of courage like I said earlier I will speak on things that I have a lived experience from or I'm educated in. Like, I'm not going to speak on something or issues that I can't relate to or I don't have information on because I don't want to spread misinformation. That's my big thing. Oh, I forgot to add the flowers to Nyx. I have to add those. Whoopsie. for me it took a lot of time to develop that courage in order to I guess advocate for myself and kind of cohesively explain my thinking and points of views and perspective so don't feel bad if you can't speak up all the time or I guess the things or for about the things you advocate for but there will come a time where you do have that courage so don't feel disheartened just yet Bravery takes time. Yeah, I, I think those types of videos are interesting, Decon, because it's one of those things where you have, like, herd mentality where you don't want to, like, cause tension or trouble. It depends on what the situation is. Like, if I feel like the individuals who are against me are potentially violent, then I won't say anything. But if it's, like, related to safety... Or, um, I guess someone's rights being violated, that to me is a problem. I will most likely stand up in that situation. Okay, there we go, we added the flowers for next. Like, you ultimately, in, a, in any type of situation where there is a potential confrontation, you have to think about your personal safety. Like, if you think that somebody is going to maybe yell at you, that sucks, and if you can handle it, defend yourself, verbally. But if you feel like people are gonna get potentially violent or make you feel unsafe, then don't speak up if you feel like you can't handle that situation. I would start the fight literally self-reporting. Guys, chatters, surprisingly I've never been in a fight. Kinda crazy, huh? I'm the biggest pacifist to ever live. <laughs> Okay, chatters, that is the last name of the day. We had a lot of people donate to stream. Oh my god. Mr. Raider, we had Butler, Mac, Orlin me up today, and then Nyx with the resub, 500 bits, and then Decon with their first ever gifted sub to the chat room. So thank you guys for donating to stream. The last call, anybody else want their name written? Central Mighty can either cheer, gift, or donate, or 
Use your channel points in the bottom corner of your chat box and I'll write your name for free. Let's go. Anybody? Mod check? Guys, we're almost at four hours. Isn't that crazy? I think I took too long eating those cookies, honestly. <laughs> Quick dose of child labor, yep. Yep. <laughs> okay, chatters, I think we have a raid today. So, once again, today was a good one. We got to try some food, we got to play some games. I finally got all three Sargo trophies in 200cc. So today was a good stream. It was a great stream. I had a fun time with you guys, but we are going to get to raid out. So chatters, gentle reminder, we only raid out to people I know. So if you are a sub, if you could type in there, chat room, peace, peace I2 spin, peace raid, and then peace I2 spin. And if you're not sub, if you could just type in peace spin, or peace raid, sorry. So chatters, copy and paste this message and type it in the chat room. We're going to be raiding out to friend of the show, Scootish. They are doing a just chatting stream right now. So if you could stick around for the raid, because chatters, if you're saving up for channel points, you, you get an extra like 300. So chatters, stick around for that raid. But I will be live again tomorrow. We are doing Kirby Star Allies, so I will see you guys tomorrow at 11 a.m. PST. I hope everybody has a great day. And I'll see you guys then. Okay. Three, 250? Fuck, I thought it was 300. Anyway. Bye guys, bye guys, bye! Bye!